What the fuck is up, everybody? We here for March Cali Burst. Kicking off the stream, we're gonna have Hype for Sliced Bread versus the Miku SSGSS, or Super Saiyan God Super Saiyan. Joining us on commentary, we got Effortless. Welcome back, homie, good to see you. We also got NorCal's number one best venom, Takanasi. All right, I'm gonna hand over the mic and we'll get this shit going. Starcy, you down to babysit the stream? Thank you. All right, let's do this shit. All right, all right, what's going on? What's going on? Good seeing you back there. Hey, yo, it is so good to be back. <laughs> <laughs> it really is. Like, I, mean, I, I was just playing like a set, like with you earlier. I was just like, oh man, I can play the game. <laughs> I can play the game. Like, uh, like, hope you're having fun with Scribes. Like, you know, you're always welcome back. <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Scribes, whatever. <laughs> it is whatever. Um, oh, man. But yeah, it's so, it's so good to be here. Cali Burst. We got a big practice here. It's like 34 people. Yeah, that's pretty good. Pretty good for a uh, definitely not dead game. So, uh, <laughs> <laughs> so uh, yeah, we, we going right into it right now. Yeah, we got a uh, hyper spike spread who came all the way up from SoCal, and we have uh, the Miku who is. I think uh, they started coming out probably a couple of months ago, like post dynamic. They're somewhere I think Central Valley, but probably more. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've definitely seen the name before, so. Oh man. Does does the stream have audio? Because I can't hear the game anyway. Uh I'm not sure. I think what we hear is probably what the stream is. No game audio yet. Um yeah, if whoever's on in chat, like can you get feedback if there's uh, game audio? Oh man, drop the combo. Alright, there we All right, go. Alright, there we go. There we go. All right. Mike and Jay, what a good button. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty OD. It's like active until landing. <laughs> 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 Gotta watch out. Oh my god, uh, bounce our shoes are on. Yeah. Oh, good back dash. I'm gonna make uh, yeah. get get flipped. Okay. Can you get a knockdown off of that? Yep. Oh my god. A little bit of risk goes a long oh, okay. way. 
Yeah, this character actually does like a grip when she hits you, definitely in this game, for sure. I don't think he's dead oh, yet. Goes go for the, the reset. reset. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> goes for the RKO, not today. Oh, okay, okay, Gets a 6P. Our oh, first yeah. game to Brad. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. Up the bar is really scary because, like, uh, even in that situation, you're not too sure if you want to go punish because you can cancel in your follow up even if it works. Yeah, which is also very cheap. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But that's a, the that's a scary thing, right? Like, if, if like, you might ask, it's like, oh, why didn't you need to try to, like, whiff like that? Like, well, if, if Red had read that, Red could have done something to punish the tent with on the tent. So sometimes right. you just got to sit back and let it. Yep, right oh there. Oh, my goodness. That's right there. That's <laughs> what we were talking about. <laughs> oh, he is hella dead. <laughs> yeah, Red has optimized routes. Oh, man. I like to start round star 6 age. Okay. Oh, my oh, God. Yeah, nice tech trap. Okay. Ooh, Mrs. ID to Tommy. Nice. I'll go for the gun for Frender. Yeah. Just kind of using it to chase down. You knew the combo wasn't going to be able to get a hard knockdown, yep. I guess. Oh my god, the oh, cheese fuzzy. Yeah. Let's finish it though. One more chance for Miku. Oh. oh. Yeah, that's as good as Ami. Yeah, and that was the red parry too, so. Red Perry the second hit. Yo, the, the, the whole Red Perry thing with Viking is like <laughs> kind of ridiculous too. So like it, it's really, really cheap actually. I, I've heard that like, I think in like what, when she was introduced in Rev 2, like the Red Perry window was a lot smaller, but I think they buffed it in the past. So now like right. from what Brett tells me, it's about the same as an IV, like in terms of timing. It used to be three frames. Seven. Oh, okay. So you, you used to have to be actually godlike. Now, any, now you don't have to be godlike. It <laughs> used anymore. to be like flashback <laughs> level, almost flashback level from like plus R, right? But now it's like IB level. Yeah. So you yeah, still yeah. have to know, but it's much more general. Yeah. Like if I ever try to do Zwy, and I try to do any, I can't do any follow up on him. I gotta just do Zwy, and that's it. <laughs> like transport Zwy, that's it, because he's gonna red parry me. <laughs> yep, you gotta watch out. Plus frames don't matter there. As long as you block it, I can get red parry. You better watch out. Yeah, I mean, she's a character that forces you to change your like block frames. I like. Yeah. You're used to like, generally against most characters, you're used to having some sort of blocking that you can just do because either it's truly gapless or it's small enough that they have to like risk a DP or something, right? Like maybe like a tiny one or two frame gap. But with Viking, it's like if you ever get too predictable and they believe enough, they can just blow you up with either a regular zombie or like the red zombie. Yeah. Yeah, it's really, really obnoxious. But the most obnoxious thing about her counter to me is how she can hold her counter. Yep. And it's so hard to play around that because like even if you like you bait the counter it's like now you have now you're in the mini game where it's right. like okay how long are they going to hold it right so exactly. then like sometimes if you're if you're point blank it's not so bad but if you're like not point blank and they like do the counter you're in like a mini game right and because you, you might as well like you, you're gonna, you kind of end up overextending sometimes if you try too hard to punish it. Yep. You try, you wait, you try to wait for it, but then she holds it all the way. You hit a button, you get murdered. Yep. You don't, you wait all the way. You try to punish it, but then she jumps away and hits you in the scramble or something. Yep. Like yep. It's, it's, it's difficult. Yep. Yeah, and it's like sometimes it's like you don't even like you're not even fully committing. You see the zombie whip, and you're like, okay, I'm gonna like run up a little bit to reposition so I can punish. But yeah, if like if they are like. Like yeah. It, yeah. It, it gets real dicey. Yeah, yeah. It's just it's really it's just it just comes down to it's not as committal as you would think it would be. What? Yeah, yeah. Alright, we're switching out uh effortless. Cause he has match play. Actually both of us are in the bracket, so uh you'll see commentators switch in and out if you aren't used to it. Pretty typical for a caliburst. I blame you. Why did you? You're running the tournament. Why did yeah, you sign I, up early? 
caught up the stream uh, for now but um yeah how's everyone Saturday hopefully it's nice and chill everyone's staying safe out there uh it's nice to have offline events again you know post post processes post like the Omicron stuff but um people are taking precautions so I think we'll all we'll be okay oh we're bringing up bread again a rare guest, so I guess he gets the extra stream time. I don't think anyone will put or object to that. <laughs> oh, never mind. Shuffled around a little. Oh, <laughs> I think we might have had some last minute substitutions. Uh, so we just dropped the bracket a bit. Okay, I guess I think we're doing Pat versus Charidine, yep. Oh. I want to say, in, before we get the match started, shout out to Sarsky. He is the one actually running the stream, handling all the stream overlay stuff. So he's the one changing the name, setting the scores, getting that set up. Uh, he was, I think in the past we've had it where we. Um, what do the commentators think they do? It's not that bad, but it's, it's nice having, like, it's kind of separated out like this, so it's not a tactic. Ooh, Green is going crazy. <laughs> Alright, <clears throat> we have a matchup here. Potemkin versus Chip. Uh, yeah, Charidine actually haven't seen him in a bit, so it's really nice for him to come out. He's, uh, he was playing Potemkin, uh, he was pretty active at events pre-pandemic. Um, Potemkin players, you can see. Uh, but we'll see. I know, I know uh, chip players hate this matchup because uh, they bleed hard, but we'll see how it goes. Right? But Tempkin has the catch chip first, so. Yo, what's good, y'all? Oh, we got Darcy. Hello, hello. Oh, immediate burst. Over to the corner. Uh, oh. oh, drop. But this could be death with that reset, yep. That American reset. Yeah. All right. That off the throwaway slow shuriken, really good for chip because in general they want that fast shuriken. It doesn't delay the fall. They can do stuff like air dash, shuriken, cover their approach much like Milliathan and get in on that. Again, once again, throws away the slow flick. shuriken, gets flicked. All right. Oh, oh there it is. Did. The Tempkin players want one thing. <laughs> and it's fucking disgusting. <laughs> Oof. Didn't now, like a second hit there, but. Oh, oh my god, nice air attack. Very rare occurrence in Guilty Gear, you know? Only a two frame uh, tech window either on the ground or in the air. Gets the hard knockdown. This is a good pot color, I agree. Oh, Ooh. deep mixies. Uh, this should be enough, especially with that meter. Yeah, as long as he doesn't oh, drop it. <laughs> Heavenly oh no, that's Buster. Yep, hard to punish that. Oh my god, baits the DP again, but this time had back uh, back dashes instead of uh, DPing and just punishes with a Gamma Blade. Yeah, Potemkin's back dash is extremely good. Very long and only one vulnerable frame. Hard to punish it, but with something as active as Gamma Blade, you can at least force them to block, and then you have frame advantage. <laughs> Scary to be that close in the corner like that. Oh my god, Hit him with the high. Alright, what's next? Oh, find me, you can't see him. Burst out. 
gets rid of the invisibility. Oh, I see PM. Oh, Ralph Liggins. You oh, can't see. Yes, God. the the ultimate mix of 5D YRC. You <laughs> can't see the red, <laughs> the 5D red flash because everything's red. Oof. That could have been dangerous. Not enough. What's the mix? Oh, that should Ooh. be it. All right, that is now on set point. Gets rid of the slow turkey. Oh, counter JD. Just love that. They're eating. So good. Mm. Oh, try to go for the air throw, I think, but mistimed it a little bit. Oh, oh two pieces yeah. get through that. Armor. armor, but Chip has fast buttons, and if he's ready to get out like that, you get blown up. Oh my oh. god, what a trade. <laughs> Not too bad though for uh, Pat because he still has big life lead. Uh, Turn sure didn't get anything for that. Oh, right, oh no! Oh. One more chance. Oh, oh, I lied. Is I? Oh, JD. Oh my God! <laughs> Good stuff to Pat. He takes a set. Look, that's terrifying. Okay, I know that DP has invulnerability, but there was still a good chance it was gonna clash with the JD. <laughs> Like you, if there's anything you have faith in, it's, it's the Temkin JD clashing. Alright. Had a little bit of a bracket mix up earlier, but uh, that's all my fault, so uh, we're getting in our next matchup here. Blame it on Starsky. Yeah. Babalu and Kelly Scrub on the stream. Okay, I think Kelly Scrub is a Venom player. Uh, yeah. Babalu either plays Raven or Faust. He's been playing a lot of Faust recently, but his longtime main is Raven. So we'll see which match, uh, which he prefers with this. What's up, Pat? Hey, chilling. Yeah, so just as a heads up, I don't know if you already talked about it on stream, but we had a, a slight bracket malfunction uh, due to some seating issues, which caused some matches to be played that uh, were not supposed to be played. So we're replaying through the ones that changed, uh, which means we're going to take a little bit longer to finish this round one than we would like. But you know what? Just means more Guilty Gear, baby. And if you got washed in your round one, yo, maybe you got that extra life. Like, you don't want to be the person that wins a round one and then loses. It's true. <laughs> that's, the, that's the ultimate salt. But it's okay. Yeah. I don't think it I don't think it affected that many matches where the outcome was that uh, unclear. But we'll see. It'd be like that sometimes. Ooh. Anyway, stepping up to the plate, we got Babalu versus Cali Scrub. Yep. Uh, Babalu has been so consistent here for such a long time that I forget that he's not actually like from NorCal. <laughs> I think because I think of him as a NorCal player. Yeah. Babalu is the world player. And Cali Scrub, we've seen him in netplay events over and over. I don't know if we've actually seen him at an event before. So welcome to Cali Scrub. Yep. I'm not sure if I've seen Cali Scrub. Yeah. Definitely online, but. Yeah. Let's see. Oh, going for the Faust. Holding it down for the Warm Rock Discord. Oh. Yo, the glitch. Yeah. It's real. I don't know why it happens. They don't see it, though, unfortunately. That would be some yeah. fucked up mix. Yeah. I assume it's just on chain side. All right. All right, we're just trying to figure out how to set our buttons here. Okay, Babu going for uh, Faust. Yeah, um, he's he's been that Faust main for a minute now. It's interesting. Um, I've played as Faust a little bit with my Venom, and I personally think this is a a solidly like I don't know what number I put up, but I'm pretty sure Venom. Is. You think? Yeah, it's. I feel like Faust his movement tools are cool, but Venom's tools are hard to move around. Yeah. You know, the, the some of that shit is slow or covers weird angles. The way I think about it is that they have similar ranges on their buttons. Yeah. But Venom's mobility is way better. Yeah. So he can bully, like, if you're very mobile with Venom, you can bully Faust on the ground. And yeah. if you're full screen, I think the average return of balls is higher than items. Like, yeah, if uh -huh. they get meteors in the party, but, like, yeah. you know, like, 
I think on average it's better to have balls on. And they're yeah, much more because stable. balls are always useful, right? right. And they're always they, they're they'll always do whatever useful. you want them to yeah, do. Yeah, exactly. So we'll see how they play. I don't know how much experience Kalistar has versus uh, Faust. Oh, yeah. J2K. All right, and get those bets in, baby. We got the blazing bets on deck. Nice. Nice. I like that. Woo! Playing very right. aggressively, I like it. Yeah, we got the, 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 the strings oh. in. Oh, goes for the full fight. Uh, uh, going my way. Yep. Gets bursted off. Yeah, J2K is actually a pretty good tool for Faust when they're kind of mid range and you expect the Venom to be poking with 2S. Yeah. They'll clear over 2S, so um, that's what will force them to do stuff like 6P yes. or Far Flash. Faust, J2K in general, just it's a weird tool to play against. Oh, oh but the no. bomb hits him from off screen. I think Kalisco thought he would be out of range. Yeah. It's tough because you didn't want to walk. You don't want to run forward, right, and risk eating a button. So he's walking oh, forward away from the button. Oh, the trade! All right. JTK putting in work right now. Yeah. Oh, all right. Babalu being boxed out. The 6P catching him. Oh, but Babalu responding with 6P of his own, and then the finish. Right Babalu now, Kalisco's um, getting a decent number of hits, but I think the issue is they're all just loose hits that allow uh, Babalu to check out. You got to, yeah. like... I want to see uh, Kalisco get those knockdowns, commit to the six H's after those ball hits to try to get the knockdown and run the mid. The Kalisco's wake up options are okay. He has yeah. an invincible reversal, but and he has five D's, but right. they're not great. Burst the grab and Kalisco looking pretty good right. this round so far. Good blocks. That that burst from Babalu was definitely uh, like nice. I can afford to lose this round, so let's let's spend it building the meter. Let's see if we can uh, go for get, the mad come back. Nice thing in YRC. Oh, doesn't believe in the hit. And the J2K. Oh, All right, no. six days hitting. The unblockable. Yeah. <laughs> Not actually. <laughs> All right, two bombs. Yep. I like that. Get out of there. Donut. Oh, all right. Six P chucks the bomb, backs off. All right, now we got the homie on deck. But yeah, Cali's probably, I don't think Fabulous uh, got meteors once yet. Yep. He probably did. Mm, the homie coming through. Not the worst though. Oh, oh no. no. All right, and Cali's okay. spending the burst. He has to. All right, yeah, wait for it. Babalu takes game one. Yeah, one good thing at least about, uh, one nice thing about that burst is that uh, since you hit them, the poison goes away. Yeah. And like, especially in low health situations like that, it's huge. Like if the poison remained, uh, Kalisco probably would have been brought to like chip level. Mm -hmm. There's like one, walking one special would be over. Yeah, and playing around items is trying to find those little things that let that like get you ever so closer to winning that match. You right, know? Like, right. A lot of items don't have big effects; they'll have small effects that can end up with a big effect on right, the round. Right, right. All right. Oh, jump forward round step nice. for both players. Babalu the first player does not want to hold that at all. Yeah, <laughs> that was gonna be a knockdown. Ooh. All right. Kalisco fighting valiantly out of the corner. He's got some meter to play with now. Okay, spends his burst. They'll send Faust back to midstream. Ooh. Go my way. All right, Good angle. Yep. Yep, I like that. That split goes low enough. Normally that uh, crawl goes under a decent number of formation. It goes oh, under no. stinger, but not when it's angled like that. Got caught mashing with the scalpel stab. All right, we got three bombs and an oil on deck. Oh, oh my, my god. god. There's a decent amount of chip damage. Yep. That was it though. Like, what do you get for 50 meters? You got a decent amount of chip damage. Yep. All right, and the helium is activated. You hear the doctor sounding extra special now. Ooh. Oh, all right, dead angle. angle to put Babalu in the corner. Oh, jumps out in time. Yeah, realizes that that ball is just not fast enough to lock him down. All right, and again with the stab. That should finish. All right, Babalu on step point coming up next. I guess Starsky out here doing some uh, some stream surgery while we got this going on. <laughs> All right. Nice. Okay. Good zoning pattern. Nice. Kalisco covers the intro oh, and nice. the trade. One problem with Faust's drill, he's really, really wide. He's very big target in the air. So oh. stuff like that can happen. Target rate hitting the backside. And we got danger time on the yep. 6 clash. Yep. Oh. Oh no! You gotta do the, the special that I learned from watching her. Ooh. You press far slash and you just buffer dash after everything <laughs> in danger time. Because then you you will cancel if you hit that. Nice. Okay. Oh, can't get the big punch because the ball. It's not looking good for Cali Scrub. Oh no. Oh no. All right. Cali Scrub fighting out of the corner here. He's got a burst on deck. He's just got to figure out yeah, for when it's Oh, no, we got Dizzy. Wow, Dizzy and he's mashing. Stop. But it's not enough. 
All right. Babley takes a 2-0. Good shit to Cali Scrub. He'll fight it out and lose this from here on out. Uh, all right. We got another match we can run on stream. Yo, Irene. 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 Is there another match we can run on stream? Oh, that was 2-0 Babalu. Yeah. All right, what we got next? Okay. All right, Bonjour's up next. Excuse me. All right. Next up, we're going to run Takanasi versus Miss Mocha May. Miss Mocha May have been out here on that grind, putting in the late, burning the midnight oil last night, mashing out all kinds of stuff. And Bonjour, aka Takanasi, aka NorCal number one best Venom, driving out all the way from Sacramento to give us that work. Django Django is truly the sound of my internal monologue. <laughs> Damn. Simo is saying Bonjour is NorCal number one Europa Universalis player. <laughs> All right, locking in those characters. We got a whole bunch of NorCal Guilty Gear in attendance. Plus, look, we got we got Bebis Max rolling up. We got we got the, the Holy Order. We got the O2 boys. We got everyone coming through. And we got straight from SoCal, hype for sliced bread, best biking on the West Coast. Always do stoked to get some out-of-town guests to come in for Caliber. Always a good time. If you ever feel like coming through, let me know in advance. We can set up some really good shit. All right, and the round start 2S from Takanashi going up against Jacko. Doesn't want to let Miss Mocha May get set up at all. Hence the Venom Ball. He'll do that. Oh, the punish on the 3H. A lot of uh, a lot of Jacko's game plan here is around just fishing for a knockdown or a quick button in the 3H or just straight 3H and using that knockdown to set up some, uh, some houses. Also, get those bets in, baby. We got the Blazing Bets on deck, ready to go. Starsky out here, handing over the keyboard while he goes and plays his matches. Round one goes to Takanasi. Okay, round start 2S again. Quick match control for Takanasi. Let's see what the mix is. All right, he's keeping up that ball pressure in. And he, oh my goodness. The overwhelming pressure using Carcass Raid to kind of cover those gaps a little bit. Wire Sea Stinger to keep things going. All right, the burst is out from this Mocha May. Trying to get something started. This is tough, though. Jacko is a character with a slow buildup. She wants to start winning and then keep winning and hit her, her win condition. And Venom is real good at not letting her get started. So game one goes to Takanasi. <laughs> Ooh, okay, round start two. It continues to work out for Bonjour. It's a good-ass button. I have a hard time challenging it. Ooh! Stuff the command grab, and yeah, he's kind of getting shot all over the place here. Miss Mocha made good first. Trying to keep him in the corner, but unable to continue with any pressure. The run grab works. And now Bonjour gets set up. Okay. Just that, that air dash in for some extra highs and the finish. Bonjour here on set point. Alright. Okay, the IV round start. Trying to get started a little, little differently. But the throw from the Conacy, that's going to send Ms. Mocha May super close to the corner. Yep. We in there. We got that full damage conversion. 
Just another day at the office for Tukonasi here. And the low. All right, Jack is back. Jack is burst back on deck. Good block on the mad struggle, but this is the last hit. All right, and the bunch coming out. Nice instant air dash. Finally gets the base out, and I just needs to let it grow. Gotta let that investment. All right. Trying to stay alive. Okay, get the get the combo, get the knockdown. Venom force the burst. But the ball strike here is rough, and the chip kill to take it. Bonjourn wins it 2 0. Good stuff to Ms. Mocha May. She'll finish it out in losers. Bonjourn moves on. So, with that, the bracket that we have available, let's see. In winners round three, we got Damendo versus Thumbtack, Babalu versus AA Landline, Hype for Slice Bread versus Uppercat, Me versus One Bin, uh, Bjorn Son of Bear versus Custom, Nuclear Papaya versus the winner of Senior Children and Starsky, and Effortless versus Darth Yeezus. Oh, and Aether Beat versus uh, Deconacy. Next up, it looks like we're going to be running. You joining me on commentary? You okay, cool. All right, so we got uh, Thumbtack versus Damendo. What up? Yeah. Yeah, Thumbtack versus Damendo. And the, 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 the chat is sending love to Thumbtack right now. Shout out to Mina Tums. Yeah, sure. All right. Give me a second. I'll update this shit real quick. Thumbtack out here, rep holding it down for the answer. <laughs> the only answer out here in NorCal right now. Here. Uh, let me just... Daymendo, meanwhile, the vampire awakens. And it's some real good stuff to see him play, as always. All right. This All is right. a pretty rare matchup. Yeah. <laughs> well, Mozik is answer track. I've never fucking seen it. We we do have footage, though. Um, there's footage of uh, Peter right, the Demendo playing you against put him down. Um, Faulty. Faulty, yeah. 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 Hey, what up, Lazy? That's right. We got answer in the house. Thumbtack been putting in that work, switching off of Chip. Like, I think it, like, it, it was hella months ago, ago at this point. Yeah. Yeah. Plays the same color, though. Oh, and the early knockdown for Thumbtack. Applying that scroll oh, pressure, yeah. but that challenge from Immediately Peter. Immediately tech yeah. the, the attempts to go for the command. And a lot of your ability to play this character oh. is, 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 is understanding how much the opponent knows about this character. Yeah. Right? Answer was late DLC. Like, a lot of people stopped playing Exit before he even came out. Yeah, I think he, I think he came with Rev, too. Ooh. Him yeah. and Viking. All right. Okay, the, the air wire C, the wire C card applying that pressure. Oh, but Luke's just to get out of there. Like nice that. 2D, yeah. The Thumbtack continuing the pressure, not scared by the damage, uh, the, the health gap at all. In fact, he's doing his best to even it out. Yep. You know, Peter out here, blocking, holding on, trying to figure out what's going on Ooh. here. Nice, so nice back that wire C into a 6P, lets him get started. Oh, but the bite, sending life totals once again. Yeah, he's wire C to make the dandy save. Favorite. 5P. Probably <laughs> probably Slayer's most like consistent reliable anti-air. Yeah. It's it's a good one. 6P is actually really hard to anti-air with. It's it really so slow, long. yeah. It will win. Yeah. The question is will you get it out fast enough? Alright. Oh wow. Oh yeah, because it's on the foot. That makes sense. Yeah. yeah. A lot of uh answer counter counterplay, <laughs> as funny as that sounds, is Doing something that touches the ground so you don't trigger the counter, yeah. and then you just punish uh, the recovery because it's all counter. Space. Yeah, it's the counter seems a lot scarier. All right, so that's game one to them today, Mendo. Uh, the counter seems a lot scarier until you realize that it doesn't activate on low hits, right? And so if it if you can make it whip, then you can just punish him on the way down. Ooh. All right, Thumbtack getting started early here. All right, got two cards and a scroll on the screen. Let's see if you can Ooh. use them. Yeah, see, that's the example there of 16 just like oh. too slow. Yeah. Oh, and the oh, burst punish. No. Okay, that tack, tack out of the corner. Able that's to get started now. Okay. All right, Peter with the challenge. Peter's doing a good job of uh, contesting uh, Thumbtack on the strings that he would be stealing a turn on, yep. right? 
Yeah, keeping that mashing going as you finish. We'll yep. see if Thumbtack has an answer for that. Maybe. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Unintentional. Boo. <laughs> Look, I'm not. I'm not. Uh, I'm not a spotter. <laughs> Shout out to spotter. I think he's playing Destiny today. That's yeah, he has right like here. a big raid today. Oh wow. Um, so apparently, you get special rewards if your uh, guild equivalent or ever completes on the first day. So. Gotcha. Oh, all right. Tax pressure strings coming in. Calls the homie for the extension. Doesn't get the full scroll combo. Oh my god. And that five P just stuffing his momentum. Now he's got fight his way out of the corner. Good use of backdash, though. Just got him out of there. Yep. All right, you're back to mid-screen. Oh. Nice RP. Yep. And that'll give him a knockdown. Wow, just jumps out of there. No fear. No suspense. I mean, look. BDC jump is a hell of an option, it's all right? true. All right, the thumbtack got the, the, the health advantage here. He set up that House of Scrolls. Oh, no, Ooh, this is an OTG. OTG. It's not going to hit. Oh, it, okay, so it does, it does hit. It does, but it's heavily much. scaled, yeah. yeah. Still, he lands the overhead afterwards. Oh, Calvin oh gets the fight. Oh, mash is out. Yeah, good mash. Oh, and yeah, don't let Slayers get away with that. You yeah. stand mash out in time. I, I do. Okay, big JH counter hit. Gets the, oh, doesn't get doesn't jump jump forward. He doesn't get a full combo, but right. still got j on the road. Oh, oh, my, what a challenge. Oh. God damn. That was looking so good for Thumbtack, too. Yeah. But just I, I do appreciate that Peter did not get grabbed there. Yeah, right? like I don't he, think he, he got grabbed them. once. He didn't, he didn't need to see it either. It wasn't like, oh, this is what I'm adapting for you. Just, oh, here it comes. I'm going to fuck you up. All right. So we'll see who's playing next. Uh, Starsky, I'm going to relinquish control to you again. All right, next up, looks like we got Hyper Slice Bread. Sitting down, I think. Let's see. Oh, I left my phone over there. Oh, I got it. Cool. Thanks, Pat. Yeah. Bread visiting in town. He had yeah. heard so much about the NorCal Guilty Gear scene. Decided to uh, fly up and, and let us know what Viking can do. And he'll be playing against Uppercat, one of our, one of NorCal's homegrown Enos. We got a bunch up here now. What? Yeah. You, have you done that before? Uh, I okay. <laughs> Pad players. Well, the thing is, from what we've heard, uh, Brett actually has not been to very many offline events. Yeah, so. that's oh, why I asked. Yeah. No, I think Brett's gone to more like melee offlines mm. than he has Guilty Gear offlines. He, he said he went to like one Wednesday night fights uh, and played some Red 2. You good? Cool. Here, traffic zero down there. And this so. is yeah. This is a, a reminder to everyone. We are offline. We got pad players in the house. Desync that shit. Check before you play your match. Check to see if there are any pads synced up and remove them. I don't think we've had anyone else playing on pads on this one, so you're probably cool. But I think all the pad players switched to hitbox. <laughs> I think all of us switched to hitbox. There, we got so there's, many hitboxes. There's still a there. couple of stick holdouts, but there are a lot of hitbox yeah. players. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I still play on stick sometimes, but you know, like, it's that it's that, that quarantine workout glow up. You know, some people are going to roll back in the office. Like, NorCal, like, a lot of tech companies starting to get people back in the office in the next month or two. And people <laughs> are going to show up with, like, you know, some people are going to show up because they're jacked because they've been working out. All of us are just going to roll up and be like, hey, anyone trying to play some gear on a hitbox? <laughs> Yeah, three sage on character select. It, it wilds out. Don't worry about it. Hey, adapt. Thank you for the 28 months. Help me appreciate it. Get those bets in, baby. Upper cavern, hyper slice bread. We've got plenty of biking experience up here, but ain't no biking quite like bread. Pressures. Oh, good challenge. I'm not Upper super familiar with this match, but I imagine it's actually not awful for you know because they still have the gas. Like, like you know, the zombie stuff is like yeah. They still have the gas like the rest of us. Yep. Oh, I love. It's true. It's not like Viking gets any, any, I think, any significant like uh, advantage in dealing with a high low. Right. Right. It's down to her other Ooh. strong tools. Yeah. If, if anything, it's probably less comfortable because wow, normally, the yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, and this, oh, that is a good thing. Yeah. Choke goes under uh, Sakura. All right. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, that's in chat. I see it. All right, the button's coming out for Uppercat. Gets knocked down with HCL. HCL is good. Yeah, the Tommy mat does co cover a lot of space that Eno wants to use for mobility. Oh, oh my, my god, god, the lucky crouch under that JP. JS, good bunch, control yeah. space. Okay, catch the back dash. Oh, yeah, the, the delay to Tommy is rough. 
delays Tommy YRC. She just gets to keep going. Yep. And Brett will tell you, a lot of how you have to deal with Viken starts with I being earlier in her string um, to, oh. to make sure she has other things to think about. If you're not if you're not challenging bike and strings with IBs, you're not putting them on notice. Then she kind of gets to do, do whatever she wants, and you have to, to call it out. All right. Oh, gets the high, gets a knockdown. Uppercut going nice to go low. Oh no. Yeah, we're starting to see a little bit more advanced movement on uppercut part, which is super cool. Oh wow! The, it would have blocked the time. Air blocked the Tommy in time. Yeah. All right. Tess Zonson gets the corner extension, and Fred should be able to. Oh no, not quite. All right, the dust. Yep. All right. You know, obviously still a threat. Oh, uppercut got the corner advantage. Goes low. Oh, all Ino right. The burst is out for Brett. No matter her health. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Eno is always scary. She's always dangerous. She can always fuck you up. Oh my oh, God. Excellent. Nice. Limboing under that note to connect to two H. Brett just barely one. too. I think if uppercut had blocked, then the note would have uh, hit. But yeah. just in time. Yeah, but I, I think she probably just wasn't expecting the low profile 2 H. Like, that's a weird button to use in that situation. Yeah. Right. Oh, it's Tommy Matt, like a wall. All right, the corner pressure coming in for Bread. Oh, gets hit by the, the you know, dive. Nice. Uppercut going in. Oh. All right, in the corner, Bread holding on to it. Pretty, uh... Pretty, pretty cautiously, I'd say. Oh, that gives uh, Uppercats, you know, the opportunity to get in. Oh my god, tech right into the high. All right, run up throw. That'll give Brad the advantage in the corner. All right, just a knockdown. And yeah, that throw bait. Uppercats staying in the corner. Nice stroke. The double high. Doesn't confirm into the combo, though, so Brett is allowed to live. Ooh, nice pressure. All RC right. pressure. Yeah, and uh, RC after that's going to give him some dust loops. Oh, not enough. Oh, first here wants to win the round. Oh. Ooh. All right, Brett here on set point. Uppercat been making these rounds close, but just unable to finish him out. Oh. Uh, yeah, that, that might be JS. Oh, oh nice. Nice six. key. Oh, no. Oh shit. Alright, wasn't expecting that. The DCL gets blocked, no punish or anything, but now Uppercat being carried to her corner. Oh. Yeah, the patience from Uppercat here. Looking really good for Red. I don't yeah. think still here, but one more. Oh, okay. nice dead angle. On the dead angle. Gets that, that JH out of here. Oh, that far ass covering that space though. Alright, and now Jesus. Red looking okay. Oh. And a clean 2-0 from Bread. Good shit to Uppercat, though. She'll fight it out and lose his bracket from here. All right. Okay. All right. Looks like Bonjour is heading off. We're going to get either B back on commentary, or is it you two playing? We're playing. Oh, cool. Nice. As we get this set up, Starcy, you wanna you wanna show that bracket real quick? You wanna show the bracket real quick, just so we, we can walk through it. Just open it up, and I'll read it out. All right. So uh, that's I think winners round three. We got Babalu versus AA Landline. Hype for sliced bread took it over Uppercat. So the winner of Babalu and AA Landline will play Demendo in winners quarters. Uh, Hype for sliced bread will play the winner of me and one bin in round three. Uh, or sorry, in winner's quarters. Uh, Bjorn, son of Bear, aka Bears, will play custom. We got Nuclear Papaya versus Senior Children, Effortless versus Darth Users, and Takanasi versus Aether Beat. We're running Takanasi versus Aether Beat right the fuck now, baby. Thank you, Starsky. All <sighs> Y'all, it is a good day in the Bay today. We had our Marvel, now we on to Rev 2. 
I think you have like 30 something people, like 35 people sign up for F2. That's what's up. I don't actually know what kind of numbers Strive is pulling these days for locals. I think I think most of their action that play or most of their actions that play these days. Alright, this is gonna be a, Vi a Venom versus Viking matchup. Alright, we're gonna get Babalu joining us on commentary. What up, homie? What you drinking? How come the monster energy can looks like uh, canned air? Like, like, it, it looks like canned air, you know, oh. like the stuff that you blow. Your <laughs> right, it's got the lid on it. Wow. Yeah. It's nice though, I don't have to worry about spilling. Yep. <laughs> like, all right. All right, get those Benson, baby. Venom versus Biker, who you like? A nice air dash over the ball. Yeah, and the IDs from, from Vondren showing that he's ready for these block things. Right. Ada B was still able to push him in the corner though and catch him on the way out. Ooh, passes the 5 p and all these IBs means his meter game is going to be through the roof. Yeah. yeah. He hasn't really spent on anything. You haven't seen him FD or anything like that. Oh, excellent. Confirmed eight or B, though. Okay, dead angle? Yeah, spend it on dead angle. Big 6P oh, from Bondry. So this is really him just getting started. He hasn't had a chance to do much this round yet. Right. Oh! oh. Yasami. Chop, chop, chop. You get that three-hit super. Gets a knockdown afterwards. I think that was Regazami, even. Oh, wow. Oh, okay, the burst. All right, I like Aether Beat spending the burst there. Yeah, before, like, Venom can get started. Unfortunately, it's still happening, though. Yep. Oh, oh the W is on that. send, and Aether Beat takes the first round. If you ever look at the hitbox of that move, she actually shrinks her hurtbox. Oh, that's fucked up. Yeah. Oh, and the ball catches Aether Beat on his way in. Good block. Yeah, good block. Oh, oh. no. Sometimes you wonder, is he actually going to hold it yeah. long enough? He to be will hold it. I feel like most of the bike as well. Okay, Ooh, the close ass counter hit. Close hit. There was a gap and he saw it. All right, angle? Then, yeah. And Aether Beat's offense has been successful enough that Vondren has spent most of his meter on defensive stuff. Right, doesn't... Yeah. Doesn't want to let uh, uh, Aether Beat's bike and get started. He doesn't yeah. have to. Okay. Oh, and the instant overhead oh. is and drops the combo, though. All right, one okay, more Okay, gets the cross here. up with the K-Ball. Okay, this could be really bad for Bike. It doesn't have much health. Okay, okay spends the first good call. I guess he's been confident. Ooh. He's been happy enough with the offense that uh, he would... Oh, my God, the pickup still Even works out. after Aether the ball hits. One. In fact, yeah. one could say the ball it maybe cut off some recovery off of him. Yeah. Yeah, you kind of got to wonder. I, I, I would be surprised if either player knew how that situation was going to work out. But uh, A to B definitely played that confidently. Oh, okay. Right. All right. The aggressive burst. You're hitting J the, the dust loops after this. Oh, goes for the Kabari reset. A to, uh, and uh, Takanashi doesn't bite. Oh, this time very smart through the Azami. Because he got Azami there last time. Yeah. All right. The corner carry is going to take A to B all the way there. Goes low. Too low. Yeah, and that route did damage. Yes, and Biken is yes. on the lower end of health. Yes. Uh, also, Aether just spent all his meter on, or most of his meter, on the dead angle, and it got baited by TD. So, okay, nice throw. Nice throw. Now, nah, this is, okay, the first. This is yeah. why Biken gets started. All right, okay. dead angle, yep. It is, it is very, you can see it is very paramount in Takanasi's mind to not let Aether get started. Yeah. Yeah, that, that was some, some real smart resource spend decisions there from, from, from Takanasi, making sure he could secure that round. And uh, Aether Beat didn't really bait anything, so right. we're, here we are in round two. But a good start for Aether Beat so far. Good to to Takami. Oh, nice IB. All right, the burst. Oh, and that vertical park is real good, but Aether Beat ends up winning the exchange off the tech button. Okay, good IBs on the Kabari. Okay, we got full screen zoning going on. Yeah, and this this just makes it harder to move. Oh, all right, A to B with the excellent approach. QS doing that work. Ah, uh, uh, throw is in. Seems around throw. A to B now on set point. This is why you want to be able to hear it. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> we were talking, to, we were joking around the other day about how all we have so many Vikings here. They they have a little bit of a house advantage because most of our sets do not have audio. Uh, in any significant sense. Okay, the corner throw. All right, smart burst. Oh, nice, nice IB throw. throw. Yeah. And yeah, 
Vaughn just can get pretty paid off this. Obviously gets a corner van, got some decent oh, damage. No. Aether beat with throw of his own though. I think and I think the Conte might be messing up that setup. Because mm -hmm. normally there shouldn't be a gap to get thrown. Alright. Kind of see. Still hits the two D. Nice oh, six B anti air. Yeah, Aether be slugging this one out. Oh, the six oh, B interrupted right the stinger. The stinger. Okay, but he Ooh. missed time his the onsen. Oh, Ooh. wow. The throw match actually worked out for Bonzer, even though he ended up getting a 5 8 instead. Okay, good shot. <gasps> the super, is this going to hit? No. No, because Carpus has very low recovery. Oh, my God, that is zombie. Nice throw from Aether Beat. He gets oh, one more shot it. at this. Okay, avoids the Kabari. Oh, my oh. God. And the future. The future oh change. Oh, my God. Aether Beat taking that two to nothing. Is it? Very significant upset. These two have known each other and played for a long time. Yeah. And uh, I mean, I did the seating on that one, but either beat, he played it out. He did the bike and shit. It worked out. And that'll send NorCal's number one Venom to loser's bracket. Good luck, Bonjour. Good luck with that loser's bracket, too. Yeah. Damn. <laughs> I mean, look, th the whole bracket is, is bloody <laughs> as fuck. But yeah, Aether Beat's been putting that work. He's been, he's, been, he's been being super consistent lately. Yeah. Um, so it's not a big surprise, but you know, it's nice to see that movement. It's nice to see, see that shake up. Right. I say when it's not me getting upset there mm -hmm. by a bike. You're not the one getting added to the list of yeah. the list on his belt. Yeah, but Bonjour was doing a lot of things right to like contain the upset uh, potential, right? Like he was bursting at points where it was clear he'd get a lot of high value out of it. It was clear that, that, that Aether Beat wasn't baiting them, right? He was spending his meter to make sure he got to play the game as much as possible. And just, it was, I think it's like somewhat like what you said, it was the drops, right? right. Like the, goal, the holes in the setup just cost him. And a lot of it was just either be fucking clutching out that last round. That was, yeah, that was either huge. Yeah, definitely was making a lot of the right decisions when it came to those like split second decisions. Yep. Azami here, Susan around here. Yeah, and, he, and he, he kept his rotation going. Like there wasn't an immediate obvious pattern. Even when he was getting hit, like Bondrian wasn't necessarily getting paid to the extent that a Venom can get paid. Right. Um, so, all right, we're going to check on real quick, see if we've got another stream match. Yo, Aaron, we got another stream match on the way? Okay. okay all we right, go. we're going to run Babalu and uh, AA Landline up next. You good? Yeah. All right. All right. We got, we got a big crew of people to help out, and that's what makes sure that we can play as well as run this event. So, uh, I don't know. It's just how we do it. It's real nice. We're, let's see. Mm. Bears, what the hell is that t-shirt? Are you wearing an NFT? All right. Babalu sitting down with player one side. Oh. So this is going to be Faust versus Elfo. And we'll get oh, we'll get the the bets going in just a second. Babalu been playing Baba Is You lately, working on them brain puzzles. So we started calling him Baba Is Lou. All right. We got one bin joining us on commentary next. There you go. One bin, did you, did you do any track or anything? What's up? Did you ever do any like track or cross country or anything like that? Uh, in high school, I, yeah. I, I played a lot of sports in high school. Oh, gotcha. I, I I think it was yesterday I saw you like like kind of like jogging out to the bathroom and I was like this, this thing's got some grace to him that I did not expect. <laughs> it's because I was almost late for work. Ah, there you go. Yeah, one one been out here been been running that graveyard shift. Yeah, he I better not. Wakes uh, up, plays games at Game Center, goes to work, <laughs> sleeps for two hours, then comes back to Game Center to grind it out in tournaments. Yeah, I better not make a losers run because I have to leave by 6:20. Oh shit, I have work. <laughs> oh, that's what's up. God damn, dude. Yeah, adapter capture card fucks up on on character select. It's weird Deal that it's it. only character select, but it, yeah. also it's good it's, that it's only character it's select. It's weird that it's only character select for two different games. Cause dude, does that on, on Marvel also? Oh. 
Oh, and it's doing it on snapback, too. I wonder if there's, like, a rendering layer or something that, for whatever reason, has a problem with. Anyway, oh, all the bets in. People betting big on Babylon. I, I would not sleep on Elfelt like that, y'all. Mm -hmm. All right, early burst from AA landline. And I do know that these two play each other quite a lot. Yeah. Like, whenever they join a lobby together, and invariably they end up on the same setup. Yeah. No matter how they try to avoid it. Yeah, there's been there's been a lot of grinding between these, these two lately. It's a good thing to see. You love to see it. Um, Ooh, and it means that and by, like, when I'm talking about grinding, like specifically a lot of Faust grinding for Babylon. Yeah. I mean, he made that character switch like a little while ago, and, uh -huh. and I've got to say, in terms of like, there's still probably more situations. Oh, oh wow! The burst into the Mega Meteor. It actually did that damage. Uh huh. All right, a bomb is on deck next. But like so much of Faust is situation recognition, you know, so you really do benefit from grinding those games. Mm -hmm. uh, because it's not something that's like easy to training mode. Just because of the RNG on his item. Okay. And I think we saw a little bit of that experience on um, uh, Landline choosing to try and snipe in reaction to the air stalling. Yeah. Which I don't think is something you would like come up with on the spot. He's definitely like Ooh. experimented with it. Alright, Pineberry is cooking. Alright, and he manages to throw it out. Okay, yeah, but the buttons work out. He gets out of mini fast way, but then another one just gets summoned. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh no. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Aaron's a very emotive player. I love to see it. Yeah. And yet, the 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 uh, neutral between these two is interesting. Both of them have uh, 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 somewhat unorthodox. Oh, big set six of starter. Ooh, yeah. Aaron's gonna get paid off this one. Oh, get the prime break juggle. Oh, well, I mean, all right, still going. Yeah. A that lot of counter hits. Yeah. And the thing is, while Elfeld buttons are good, they're active, they can do good damage, right? She's got great routes off of them. Faust buttons are always really fast for the amount of space that they cover. Yeah, he can get a lot of favorable trades. Or, yeah, trades. Yeah. All, All right, right Meteor coming. Yeah. Burst out. Mm -hmm. Meteor doesn't really do that much extra damage, but yeah. there goes the burst. I like that. He got rid of, he didn't have to worry about Meteor. He ended the combo and he got out of the corner. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh. All right. Oh, getting set up. All right, just posing up with a shotgun. Nice. Press gets landing. Okay. This should kill. Oh, no, not quite. Oh, Could have it. narrowly misses the 6P, and that gives Babalu enough time to eat the donut. I want to Oh, this I'm should kill, yeah, for sure. All right, big damage out here. Nice ID over JDYC to punish the scalpel. Is that Marlon Pie playing Drummania right now? I can't <laughs> tell. I think so. I know, it might be Fred. No, Fred's playing up stuff. All right, Faust pressure coming in for Babalu. We have one round apiece. The bomb slowed the pace down a little bit. Oh, nice morphing in the block, the pine bearing. Got another bomb on the screen. All right, checking the donut, another donut. Babalu making me hungry. I think both, both characters are willing to just uh, go full screen, pull a bomb, and then just like have it sit in the middle and yeah. see who approaches. The, oh, the risk is big on, on a landline. They end up getting counter hit from the 6H, and then that big, or the, uh, the hammer, and that big 6H did a lot of damage. And this is tough. Oh. Like, Aaron is, Aaron, Aaron is not managed to figure out how to get past this wall in neutral. Yeah. And as long as 6H keeps opening him up, mm -hmm. uh, Bamboo gets to play his game for as long as he wants. Oh, wow. Yeah. The. <laughs> The sacrifice unblockable to finish off the bomb. Babalu takes game one. Whenever like Faust knows he has meteors and just runs up and does that, it's like I know it's coming, but I have no idea what to do about it. Yep. This this game, I think LK was the one who called it a selfish game because everyone gets to kind of do the stuff that they want to do. You know, mm -hmm. Faust gets to put you in a lot of fucked up positions. Oh my oh, god. Nice. All right, Pineberry Oki gets into shotgun stance, but the, the 2P match from Babalu mm -hmm. sends him out. Oh, wow. We playing Duck Hunt here on that JPK? Oh, almost gets confirmed. A little too high. Faust's uh, error hurt box, it's kind of like weird. It, yeah. it could often be hard to tell where the middle of his body is. Yeah, Yeah, depending on what state he's in, his, his center, like the root of his character, might be more forward or back than you expect. He's got these long ass legs that make it a little harder to read. Oh, oh back versus Babalu. Yep. And A landline's gonna come in here. Babalu's spending all the meter on FD. He yeah, he, he to needs to push him out to get to get into a viable 2P range. Yeah. Okay, oh, Mega that's, meteor. A, that's a big meteor, yeah. yeah. So that's actually easier to avoid. It certainly is. Yeah. 
Oh, it, kind of, it kind of forces the Faust to be aggressive. Yeah. Otherwise, he's just going to get pushed into the corner and then it's going to go over you, which is not exactly what Faust is normally wanting to do. Oh. All right. Oh, nice counter hit. Oh, good confirm. Oh, but the Jazz. Button. This is oh, going Momo oh, coming. No. Oh, yes, and doesn't, like, yes, he managed to avoid uh, Mini Faust. Yeah, and, and also, like, Babalu went into going my way, I think expecting that combo to kill, but because it was a little higher, it ended up finishing higher than he wanted to, right? Yeah. Ideally, for Faust combos, going my way usually puts you on the ground afterwards. Yeah. You don't finish the, the arc. Oh, uh, yeah. All right, blocks the teleport. Elfelt's still in the corner, eats the far S. All right, manages to avoid the mini foul. It's Elfelt's turn. All right, Pineberry to keep up the pressure. Oh, uh, but no cancel on the 6H gets, uh, or can get knocked down or anything. Oh. oh, almost like just a straight up punish. Yeah, and it looked like he was even delaying his air button because he knew he had a <laughs> roll under the yeah. far slash. That's far slash, right? Yeah. Yeah. All right, scalpel snap, picks up, big chop. That golden hammer, it instant stuns, right? Is that how? Uh, I or think just it like a, a lot, lot of stun. stun. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I think on counter hit will often stun or instant stun, but it's uh, it's not it's not 100 percent the way there. Oh, nice! Avoids with the the six H, mm -hmm. gets the gun, oh, catches right, and jumping. Back. The dead angle from Babalu to get his round started. He's one though. hit and oh JTK yeah. JTK the god managed to even stop that elf elf far F. Ooh, okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> and the early gold burst for AA Land. I'll just let it rip. Yeah. it immediately and then wire seeing to get that air throw. It's not the most expensive air throw. I've definitely gold bursted oh, just to wow. get a throw before. Mm -hmm. But yeah, it's. Uh, whenever I see close. someone do an accidental gold burst, I'm always looking for the next five seconds to see how they spend their meter, and it tends, it tends to be pretty reckless. I mean, look, you want to spend it so you can make it back, you know? Exactly. Okay, okay. okay. Block the block. The yes, and then yep. gets the 5 H punish. That was doing a really good job of staying, uh, remaining evasive. Yeah, and I, I love, I love the the, um, the amount of neutral that we're playing out here. Mm -hmm. You know, like no one's being overly reckless, no one's over committing to anything. I think Lan's nice getting block. a Lan's getting a good like sense of when he like when he wants to when he's trying to do far slash scalpel and he's jumping. Yeah, and like landing with a JS, but maybe with a little more conviction, he could do an ID JD YC and just get a full on punish. Yeah, ID on Faust is tricky. A lot of his anti airs are unexpectedly good yeah especially when they trade yeah oh nice air throw from a landline he's one hit away from yep. taking the game babalu out of meter he's, uh, he's flashing yeah all right make some space to teleport in hit oh it doesn't get the air fp he's though he's in air tech situation yeah oh. that jh is so good one hit all okay right. yep got him and yeah, going yes. right to sniper from here. it's hard to contest babalu out of meter oh my god eight seconds left on the clock Good. Oh, oh, the dust! Finishing with 5D of all the things you can finish with, 5D tying it up, 1-1 one, one for AA Landline. God damn! Man, I'm hungry as a motherfucker right now. It's all these donuts and candy bars <laughs> and shit. All right, both both players choosing to rehydrate. Babalu powering up. I had to choose between food or showing up to uh, Marvel on time, and I chose ah. Marvel. <laughs> It felt Wait, weird. So what, what are you drinking right now? Is that just a, a Red, Red Bull? Bull? Oh my God! Red Bull on an empty stomach. Jesus Christ! I left the house with a coffee, drank it, and then saved this for after, um, or when uh, I just started. You know, like, your stomach lining is gonna hate you when you're my age. I'm just. You know, uh, you know, do you remember Red Bull Conquest? Yeah. I TO'd that event, and um, uh, I think I drank like eight Red Bulls by the end of the night. Oh my God! Because you know they had like that big cosmetic like Red Bull yeah. thing with like yeah. I just I just kept on necking them, and I stayed to like help tear down the event. It was like. Midnight, I'm driving home from Oakland. I'm just like, I, was like, I felt like I was in GTA. Yeah, look, these, these nerds do not deserve you one bit. All right, <laughs> Shablu character switching back to Raven. Oh, interesting. Trying to get that advantage of having two mains. Two mains! Uh, I've definitely, <laughs> I definitely tried that strategy with mixed results. It's, it's hard, right? Like, CT Warrior made it look easy when he's switching between three or four characters over a single tournament run. He really did. Uh, but the, the fact is that you have to change how you think about each matchup. Your muscle memory has to change. Like, mm -hmm. any consistency you had in the read is reset for both players. But if you can pull it off, it's, it's great for that exact same reason, right? Definitely. If you think they smell out something that you can't deal with, 
switching to another character can fuck that up. Oh, uh -huh. the mash from Babalu. All right, gets knocked down. Ball is set. Glides back in. 5D hits. I will say I am a little surprised that he did um, do the character switch though, because it's not like that was like a like a, a bad game too. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. I think if I had to guess, I would say okay, one worked out for for Babalu so far. Uh huh. My my guess would be that like all those games were really long, right? Oh, yeah, true. And yeah. since Babalu, even though they've been grinding, right, and they've specifically been grinding together for a long, for a while now, like. You know how deep you can go in a set with a character, right? If you feel like you're just like you're out of thing, you got nothing in your back pocket for that game three. I can see switching, especially when he played Raven for so long. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, all right, Aaron, getting that damage in. Like as far as I know, Babalu is always going to Raven main, so I wonder if this is actually the first time he's been switching between mains mid turn. So, Babalu actually used to play main. Oh, okay. So oh, he, yes, that's he, true, he yeah. He play main that much out here, I don't think. But yeah, it's, it's, it's a good question. Oh, all right, that JD narrowly missing. Aaron out now chasing Babalu down. Babalu spends the burst. Mm -hmm. Wants to win it right here. Okay. And, and I like the needle zoning stopping uh, Aaron from getting out like a free pine berry or something. Mm -hmm. Ooh, big 5D. <laughs> really, they're really just yep. jumping over each other. Finally yep. got speed landing, yeah. Oh, and that 2H hit. Really juicy 2H. All right, Babu's got a bunch of meters. Spends it to go back in. He's still got enough to wire see something. Oh, he's going to go there for the air throw, yep. All right. Bunch of risk built up. He's got the glide. Nice block on the dust. It. Holds the 5 and actually gets the, uh, Aaron gets the knockdown there. Oh, nice yes. air throw. And one hit away from taking it. Oh, landlines in chip range. Oh, oh yeah. I think Aaron, that was supposed to be an air throw, but yeah. in the end, it still works. Yeah, Aaron playing out of his mind there on that last one. Mm -hmm. uh, I think, yeah, it was the, probably the air backdash that stopped him from getting the air throw, though, and mm -hmm. Babu was able to clutch it out. Yep. God damn. Aaron out here always. All right, it's us two. Yeah, that's why I hopped on commentary. Gotcha. Okay. Well, we'll get on here. Next match coming up, one band versus Pat the Flip. All right, here we go. Getting Pat on Chip versus one on Sim. He's been like playing a multitude of characters. I've seen him play Venom. I've seen him play Slayer. Oh, okay. I was wondering. I was like, oh, who does he play? <laughs> he picks it. I was like, eh, that doesn't. Like this is this is the character like I've There's seen. Not too many sins here, you know. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm like, okay. Yeah. No. I, he, He's played like, a lot of Sin in the past. I've primarily known him for Sin, but I, I know he's been like meandering around characters lately. Okay, let's see. I feel like uh, Sin should do okay in this match, but at the same time, you know, Chip is just so hard to catch. Yeah, so. Chip, Chip is very hard to pin down, but like out of nowhere, if Sin gets one hit, that's all he needs. Yeah. That's the round start. Back Our dash. dash. Uh, Both showing respect. Pat a very like somewhat patient Chip player, walks the back dash and just gets to find me. Yeah, he, he definitely believes in safety, yeah. for sure. <laughs> oh, yeah. I mean, when you play with a with help bar like Chip, like, you, you don't want to get hit. Yeah. Ooh, catch him with the JS. Okay, early it. burst. Catches him on the way down with the JS. That was so great. But that, like, trying to keep Chip in the corner is just so hard because he just teleports right out. Yeah. And you have to, like, feel on your guard to uh, catch that. Okay, he's not dead here, but he can oh, like here. counter hits okay, that's gonna be enough. Nice. Okay. Quick game one from Pat yep. Flip. Quick round one. Alright. Yeah, I'll probably get a very similar round start. Get the mm -hmm. get the full screen, set up to find me. Hit him with the invis hit him while invisible. Cheap shit. Oh man. But six P. Sin six P really good. How did he see him? 
<laughs> it was it was a it was a faith six P. <laughs> nice two D. Oh man. And there's that sin damage. Alright. You might be able to kill in the next exchange, maybe. Oh, especially with a wrist cranking. Ooh, reset Ooh. him with a JD. And get the J in the, okay. the uh, beak driver loops. That was clean. Got the knockdown, got what he wanted. Yeah. Ooh, cool. See, uh, representing the backdash, pad adapting, goes for uh, Alpha Blade round start. Yeah. Gotta mix it up. Okay. Nice block of the mix up. Back to neutral. Pat pressing. Ooh, nice, gets their uh, 2K. Okay, what's the mix? Okay, we, we go high. Ooh, but Camel is gonna catch. Oh, Ooh, misses man. the 5H though. Yeah, he's getting kinda hit a lot. Get hot low. Right, this should be enough. Yeah, that's it. Doesn't even need to spend the meter. That was a pretty clean. If you're a chip player, I mean, that's kind of like what you want your matches to look like. Get yeah. him in the corner, run the mix, get the hit, cash out with the super at the end. Yep. And uh, lose as little as possible. And get his hit, <laughs> get his hit as few times as possible because every hit matters when you're, when you're playing a chip. I think if you're a chip player, you always have to just imagine that you have like Two hit points. Like, yeah, basically. Like, <laughs> oh, nice air throw. It's a safe jump. Bates out the throw, but it's not going to yeah. get a big punish. RC nice. into the 5D. This should be enough. It takes some of that burst with mm. you. That was clean. All right. Another very passive round start. Catch him with a 2P. Okay, gets the throw. Safe jump still looking to beat out throw. Yeah. Ooh, the wire seems to be safe. Nice. Comes down with it. Gets oh the throw. Man. Yeah, wins the scramble there. Ooh, catch him with the counter hit JD. Immediately spends the burst. Yeah. 6P. Nice anti air. Yeah. Safe. One been opting to spend burst. Doesn't want to let uh, Pat get started. Catch him with the overhead. Yeah, both bursts are off the table. So now we're playing for keeps out here. Yep. Knock down. Nice block, but we're getting caught low. Catch low again. Oh, Ooh, reset the them with a the leaf grab with a 100 meter. This should be enough. Nice. All right. And then, you know, he saved that right for the end, too, you know? Yep. That is one of those players who, like, represents leaf grab once in a blue moon. All right, now what match are we going to get next? Because I think Pat sinks himself into winner's quarterfinals. I think. Or they, maybe that's a uh, semifinals. Okay. Yeah, that was semifinals. So now he's in winner's quarterfinals. Okay. So we, that he's going to be fighting Hype for sliced bread. Yo, where'd bread go? Bread to the stream setup. Yo, Pat! Bread's over here. All right, we're going to get Bread versus Pat. All right. That other winner's quarterfinal. So, yeah, we, we got Fabulu versus Demendo. We got High Precise Bread versus Pat. We got Custom versus Nuclear Pavai. And you got me versus you. <laughs> Ain't that funny. <laughs> so yeah, we got winner's quarterfinals up here. Chip versus Viking is a very polarizing matchup where... If you're not tight with your Oki as Chip, you can get caught by a zombie and then you just kind of die for it. Yeah, yeah, for sure. I don't know. I feel like also on the uh, flip side of that, I feel like Viking actually has pretty good neutral with like, you know, being able to control the screen with yeah. the Tommy and the Kabari and stuff. So yeah. it's just kind of like, I feel like Chip is pretty good at navigating all of that. So I feel like, you know, it's very weird. It's like a very back and forth because like ID back to Tommy is so good at like catching like the stray teleport sometimes. Like oh, if you, okay. If you commit to okay. like uh, K teleport and you ID back to Tommy, you will just catch them and you will counter hit them and you'll mm. get a knockdown. You get a Tommy set. You get you get set play into Oki. Yeah, it, it always sucks to just get hit by like a random to Tommy into yeah. like a knockdown. You're like that. that that's the name. Of, that's like, the. Damn. That's what sucks <laughs> about fighting Viking. You get caught by one random to Tommy. Oh, you're fucked. <laughs> uh, be like that. Sucks to be you. Shouldn't shouldn't have gotten hit. Round start, immediately caught with the JP. Ooh, yep, 6P. Yeah, he got under the timing. 
unfortunately, doesn't try to get a knockdown. Ooh, nice JH. He looked like he may have tried to air grab him, but he yep. missed it. Takes the first point, sends to send Pat into the corner. Fred okay. really wants this match. Ooh, nice, throw him into the corner. Here's the okay. dust loops. Okay, sends the burst. Good first point, too. Yeah, yep, see, this is what I'm talking about. There's a where you just Kira, you just Tommy back. Nice, oh, catch him with those. use the Zami. And then runs under to make sure you get to the dust loop. Oh. oh. Yep. That's what sucks about that sometimes. A bit too far, and he's next to Kuchinashi now. Pat's got the corner position. Oh, wait, man. Is he dead? Uh, well, you got to get through a lot of guts. Level 4 guts. Oh, Ooh, it's enough. Let's go. Yeah, Chip and Bike can both have level 4 guts. All right, catch him with a JP again. Nice match on the far slash. All right, this is where we want to be. Keep him in the corner, JH, yep. Oh, man. Pat's trying to get out of there. I know, I know the feeling. Yeah, I know. <laughs> when this character has you in the corner and like starts locking you down with JH and Kabari, it can be really scary. Especially like stuff like that. Yeah, okay, finally the jump, jump works. Oh, the zombie. Yep, missed the throw. Sometimes you feel like such an idiot when that happens. Yeah, it's just like, it, of it, course! That, that, <laughs> it is, it be what it be. <laughs> you don't think it'd be like that, but it do. <laughs> Alright, gets the gets the burst off. Oh, uh, again. Yeah, JH is a very like a very weird normal to use for Chip. Cause like half the time, if you commit to Kuchinashi too early, the second hit of JH catches you. But mm. if you uh, if you wait for the second hit, uh, you can counter hit them. Hmm, okay. And you, and you get your fat, and you always get your fattest rewards off of uh, a zombie fall ups one counter hit. Yeah. And the burst is a bit, yeah, a bit too uh, ambitious on that burst bait. Yeah. Okay. I don't know for the burst bait, but it's like, uh, burst is just a bit too large. Okay, get the hit. You should get a knockdown here. Alright. Nice. RC. Yeah. Man, we are just moving out here. Yeah, I think Pat, he's trying to be a little bit more tricky, a little more ambiguous about what he's going to do. He yep. doesn't want to get a Gami again. No, clearly not. Ooh, Ooh. yeah, see? The, the only follow-up that uh, Lycan has that is in Volt is Sakura, so if committed to any other follow-up, you can actually stuff her. But then you might get stuffed by Sakura and get counter-hit, and then that's a lot of damage. Okay, he gets a throw, but this is not going to kill. And he doesn't have meter, so... But we got the knockdown. Here's the set. But that meter is right there. So you have to be careful. Okay. Bends it on the RC. Tries to be safe. We got yeah, one chance. Yeah, OTG's yeah, yeah. not going to kill. And chip damage. Yeah. Now, Brett going up game one. Now, that was a very, like, back and forth game one. Yeah, 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 yeah. Taking the time. I mean, for the most part, I mean, he got hit by a lot of the zombies. So, you know. Yeah, and that, and like I think Pat mentioned this earlier, is like we have a lot of Vikings here in NorCal, but no Viking plays quite like Red. All right, just a hit. Okay. Maybe since the they take the burst point on the King Kuril. Yeah. Nice two H, but he's not gonna get into a knockdown. Mm, this is bad right here. Yep. And he's got the bar too. Yeah, PRC okay. to be safe. Catch him with the Sakura. Expends the burst. Pretty good for Pat, actually. Even yep. though he has the meter advantage right now. So. Ooh. Oh, oh, I kiss him with the FGP. Man. Yeah, that's like. That's, that's cheap shit right there. Yeah, it is. It's like, it happens so fast. Like, he kind of steals a turn when he does that, but if you if you let him do that, you'll get caught. Yep, it's a. Uh, it's a uh, Sabaki. Yeah, just wait it. Yeah, he calls out the carry with a 6P. Nice tech JS. And again, another 6 feet. Chip 6 feet is so good. Yeah, nice anti air. Ooh. Oh, yep, stops out of the Oracle Sogi. And holds it. Nice. Is it a blitz? Wow, the, a blitz from Viking? Are you serious? Uh, that, so there are certain scenarios in which you, like, you, you really do need to. <laughs> you need to represent it, because some things are a zombie safe. Ooh, gets caught by the Oracle Sogi. And then it's really funny in like the uh, the Blitz War scenarios, where you just oh, oh I see you're gonna charge Blitz again. I'm just gonna hold a zombie. He can hold. Oh my god. And ooh, then you counter. Oh, ooh, okay. nice from Pat. That was good. 
All right. And we are making the distance, oh, but the ID for the zombie. Yeah, zombie in the air. Yep. Why does he have that? <laughs> Walk forward throw. Oh, unfortunate. Takes yeah. the OTG. Yeah, trying to keep Pat here locked in the corner. Super jump. Ooh, nice teleport nice. up. He's going to get the throw. Now, yeah, Viking stuck in the corner. I being. Yeah, see, he's, trying, he's being a little more invasive with his movement there. Yep. Doesn't want to get a zombie. Oh, ooh, IED uh, air zombies and gets the Kikio to create uh, cover a lot of ground movement. Yeah, catch him with the low. Oh, watch the leg. Yep. Probably like fuzzy, uh, just to uh, catch him fuzzy blocking. Oh, there it is. Nice blocking the Fiki. Oh, yes. Nice block. Walk out the corner. Thank Nancy you. In the corner. Oh, this is bad. Got them bar. Oh. No. Yeah. Oh, yeah, nothing you can do. You got that was hard to burst. anyway. Very hard to burst. You know, good shit to Pat. That's like Pat. one of those situations where you're just like, all right. Yep. I'm going to either hold back or hold down back. Oh, yeah. Which one? <laughs> that, that's, that's what's so fucked about Viking. 50 meters, she gets a 50-50 for just standing next to you. <laughs> that's just fucked up. <laughs> Which one am I going to commit to? Yep. So it looks like we got custom up here. Custom and nuclear papaya. I heard, I heard nuclear papaya is playing Eno this bracket. And oh, okay, cool. And Not custom our uh, residents, one of our resident slayers. One of our many slayers here. Slayer is actually a really popular character. Yeah. Yeah, no, we got like we got the Mando out here. We got custom right here. We have uh, Sows somewhere. Also, wow. Okay, I, I forgot. It was, I forgot the. Uh, <laughs> they're just like, seizure was that bad. <laughs> In Marvel, it wasn't actually that bad. <laughs> oh no, he's playing Ram. Oh, all right. I guess one. I I, I think he's playing. I heard like Jeremy say he was playing. You know, but off the Ram. Now this is. We don't see this matchup here very often. We only, we only really see this matchup when uh, Nuclear Pyre makes it out. Nice PDC. Yeah, I kind of feel like this could be a little annoying for Flair. Yeah, and ooh, commits the Pile Bunker. Yeah, but ooh, nice beat Dandy. Oh the my god, beat. right into the 5D. I see, I see who you are. Yeah. <laughs> nice, ooh, doesn't. <laughs> All right, nice, get him with the low, get to the fight. Nice match from Nuclear Papaya. Yeah, and jumps yeah. over to try and steal the he, corner. He definitely got to represent that. He is trying to take your life away. Especially when you especially when you fight a Slayer and like they can just delete your health bar so quickly. Kind of a close slash. No big confirm. Oh! They're straight down to Andy. Ooh. Snatches them out of the sky. Okay, what's the mix? Oh, and Trey's tra going to pay out for custom here. Yeah, he, he was mashing, which I agree. <laughs> it can I be agree. scary to match. I agree. Oh, get it's off late. Because heaven forbid you get counter hit by that shit, you about to eat so much damage. Oh wow, you got the knockdown off of that. Nice. All right. Ooh, the sword Ooh. covering behind him. Yeah, that was sick. All right, gets the sword back. Uh, and he's not oh. gonna get a big punish on that uh, charge blitz. Yeah. Okay, though, he's got the life lead. Play a little neutral. Yeah, catch him with the 2S. Gets a knockdown. Nice, BDC. Yeah, BDC bite again. BDC bite again. There you go. Get off me. Oh. And here's the burst super. That did so much damage. And just like that, Custom is oh, back in the game. trying to rob him. That's, that's what Slayer do. <laughs> you thought All that right. mask was for COVID? Nah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but oh, he's got him. Oh. Unfortunately, we got one chance. Ooh, the <laughs> foot loose. <laughs> yeah, no, you can never count a Slayer out. Because just like that, with one burst super, all of a sudden the game was like very tight up. Yeah. Because with a 6P. Oh, he missed the pile bunker. There we go. All right, we got those Tekken juggles. 
Nice. There's the 5D. Okay. Doesn't get like proper Oki. But Uber okay. trying to blitz. Ooh. Hard oh. blitz. We're going to get max charge. Okay. Simple combo. Get the knockdown. Get Oh, yeah, nice back oh, dash he's up. He's got so much meter. He's got to be so careful. Yo, he just did burst sweeper. YRC. Yo, he just spent everything. Yep. And now we're going to get juggled. Oh, doesn't get crosswise? I think I think JH might actually get low enough to hit crosswise. Okay. You know, it's always so scary to fight. Um, people like this who are like so insistent on certain things. Yeah. Because you're like, well, I should be able to stop them, but you have to stop them though. Yeah. <laughs> if you don't, <laughs> they're just going to keep going. They will counter hit JH. Gets to the ground faster. There's the okay. BDC DOT. Nice RC. Nice block on the overhead. There's the crosswise heal. Okay. They get the fire up to spend the burst. Yeah, both with no burst. Slayer with the meter advantage. Yep. Okay. JH works out. We're going to carry so far to the corner. We get there. Let's go. This character is so cheap. Yo, coast to coast combos. You love to oh, see him. He tried to, like, rob him. There's too. another DOT. Uh, that's what Custom is known for. Oh! Wait, that, that's going to counter hit. Not to spend the burst. Custom's got one chance. And catch him with a far yeah. slash. Ooh, all right. Tries to back dash out. Or dandy out. Doesn't quite catch him with a 16. Yeah, Nuke Pai, he looks like he's kind of taking to the skies right now. Yeah. <laughs> he's, he's committing to, like, not <laughs> wanting to play the ground game against uh, Slayer. Which, I, you know, I, I understand. Yeah. Okay, what's the mix? Especially when you can... Oh, oh my god. Four dash out. Dash is out, but we're still stuck here in the corner. You think you can get out of here? Okay. There's the 5D. Ops has been the burst. Okay, good burst. Yes, 5P, stop it. Get off me. This should be enough. Oh, oh no, what's there's a straight down to Oh eight. my god. And the trade. <laughs> Damn, that shit traded. <laughs> that 4P didn't kill, that was gonna be one hell of a trade. Okay. Oh, the 2 H. Ooh, but catch him with the 2S. That is definitely a great button for Slayer. <laughs> yep. <laughs> but ooh, the sword is going to actually catch the attempt to get out of the corner. Ooh, ooh nice crosswise heal. Doesn't quite go for an aerosol reset. Doesn't quite go for, like, the tech trap. Oh, nice punish on the burst. Cool. But unfortunately, we don't get a big combo. Ooh, a bit too early for the bite. Oh, my God. 5H hit into the sky. Oh, we got those? Okay. He's got to spend the burst. Oh my god, JH hitting so low. Uh, and okay. Nice. Yeah, 4P is going to cover the uh, dash to try and get out of the corner. Yeah, it seems like right now. Ooh! Yep. <laughs> Unfortunately, <laughs> it's a bit too high. We are, we are just committing the pile bunker. Okay, there goes that 2H again. Yep, and here are the crosswise. Nice. Yeah, he's starting to, starting to use uh, crosswise to answer yeah. the, uh, the, the jump-ins. Yeah, the JH, especially that's uh, been proving so well for nuclear papaya. That's the system that adaptation. Counter hit. Tries oh, to reset with a 5D. Yes. Uh, get off me. I will mash and hit stun, block stun. It doesn't matter. I don't respect you. <laughs> you, you think I'm just going to respect you? You're a slayer. You don't respect me. Why should I respect you? Oh, oh nice burst. Okay. All right. Ooh, ooh, oh, nice. Another no. Andrew with a crosswise heal. And now we are going to final round. <laughs> final game, final round. You love to see it. Yeah, I love to see it. I'm seeing both players, you know, we, we see the match going on right now. Yeah. You know? We're seeing the adjustments. It's a lot of back and forth. Nice. Stuff's the dandy. Nice IBs, and we're going to get a punish. Ooh, the trade, maybe. Okay. Here's the point paying out for a uh, custom. Counter oh. hit. Oh, but drops the combo, though. Oh. Counter hit pile bunker. Okay, burst. Yep. I understand that. You don't want to hold that. And here with the crosswise again. A bit too high. Oh man, it's scary. You don't have burst to save you now. Oh! Yep. Nice. Another counter hit. 
Okay. Maybe a fat combo. Okay. We'll take that. Custom does have burst. Ooh. There oh. it is! Is he dead? No, he's got one life! Oh! No chance! Yo! This is the throw! Oh. Let's go! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck this character indeed, Aaron. <laughs> Yo, that was sick. <laughs> oh, God. Well. We trade one Slayer for another because now Demendo <laughs> is up on the cab. <laughs> yeah. You better clip that shit. That shit was tight. <laughs> Babaloo to the stream setup. Babaloo to the stream setup. So I wonder if Babaloo will run the Faust or the Raven. Raven. I, you know what? That was the first time I'd seen him switch to Raven in a long time. Oh, okay. Like, I, I've primarily seen him play Faust. Like, the entire the entirety of this year, like, and like a couple months before that, he's been playing Faust almost exclusively. So, uh, to, it's good to see him still picking up Raven. <laughs> it's yeah, good to see he's still got the Raven. He's like it's still there. So you're saying you should expect to see False here. I and then False is probably the uh, the better I'd, matchup. For sure, I'd so. expect uh, because uh, it depends. Uh, uh, Raven does have a lot of like multi-hitting moves. Like if you get close up and you like do like close slash, it's mm -hmm. like three or it's like two hits. You might be able to catch the back dash with that. Yeah, that's, nah, that's true too. And uh, it looks like we're going to Raven. Oh, okay. I, at least I see it. And that is indeed what we are doing. We are going to Raven. And, like 2 H actually will do, I think 2 H actually might do really well against catching, catching Dandy. Oh yeah, that's, like, that's you, true too. If you try to dash up, uh, you just 2 H that I forgot about that button. Mm -hmm. 2H is a good button. Touch the pin. Yeah. But they meant a, a, a player who's willing to kind of just stand and be like, okay, let's, let's, let's assess the situation. ID's over. Ooh, nice. nice. Got the knockdown. Yeah, I mean, this is kind of the nature of the matchup, I guess. Cause okay. The knockdown. Trying to create some crazy mix up there. Nice 4P okay. mash. Get off me. RCs. A nice. Okay, the super jump, pin wire C to try and just see what's going on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's actually a really strong just option, just in general, just to super jump straight up or just jump straight up, see what's going on, kind of threaten with the idea that you might get out the corner, but don't, you yeah. know? Yeah, don't, don't don't commit to an option until you're absolutely certain you have to. Oh, there's the super. Yeah. I need these the burst. That super has counter hit state recovery, so yeah, yep. that was going to do a lot of damage. Yep. And he'll he'll have about half of his burst back for round two, so he'll he'll have opportunities to make it back. Ooh, that's a counter hit. Nice mash. Oh my god, 6 8. Okay. The god button. That's a counter hit. Yo. Here we are. Raven's world right here. Yep, get the ball, Oki. Okay. And then just backs off. Kind of wait for Demendo to commit to something. Nice Catch him fancier with a 5H. Yeah, Babu is playing pretty good so far. Even though he's down a game, I, I like what I see right now. Yep, ooh, nice blocks. RC's be safe. 6H is right over the 2P. Oh, counter hit 6P. No. You don't want to get hit by that. But you got all this meter. Okay. Will you get an opportunity to spend it? Let's find out. Ooh, nice blitz. Tries to blitz oh, back with the CK. Oh, okay to beat the blitz. Nice. He wins the scramble. Oh, he, yeah. He was he was definitely trying to look oh. for that. Ooh. Damn. Yeah, I like I like how uh, Babalu, even though he had like almost hundred meter. I mean. Raven has a reversal super, but he didn't just go just, to it yeah. immediately, you know? Sometimes just having the threat of it is, is, is just, just as good, really. Yeah, I know. And then also, like, doesn't immediately commit to dead angle as well. Right, exactly. Don't even commit to the safe option, the more safer option. 
Oh, nice. Use the invul frame to right through that uh, it, uh, Undertale. Not here. Oh, man, yeah. that Raven Dash, bro. Raven Dash is it's so, so good. good in like, that neutral <laughs> footsies in direction. So <laughs> I got mad when I just saw what I just saw just now. I was like, yeah. All right. Nice. Just up jump, jumps out of the uh, cross up stuff. Knows that, okay, I can jump out of this. Oh, oh wow. Antiers. That was like some big brain going on right there. No run up YRC to try and maybe eat, eat the like back throw or jump input and just throw them. That's just cheap. Nice. Okay. They both got meter though and burst. Oh, catch him with the oh, 6k. Yeah. Will he spend burst? Oh, well, Demando will spend burst though. on super. Yeah, at least he got him to use his burst though. Yep, and spends the super. Yeah, and the trade is going to pay out for Demendo. Demendo now on set point. Okay. Nice again. Yeah, that, that four dash, bro, is crazy. It's Raven four dash is so good. Counter oh, hit. No. It's late. Yeah, it's going to be fat damage. Undertow? Oh. That's Undertow. I'm trying to remember what the... Dandy S's. Oh. Nice block on the burst. This should be enough. Yeah. There really wasn't like a really good spot to burst there. I mean, he could try to like gold burst, yeah. but it, even then, it like he might have still like may have not have just faded it. Yeah. And then like you're still stuck in the situation. So, but maybe not better than nothing. Uh, is that still? Okay. Side top side it, top yeah. Top so the winner of this will play custom, custom yeah. And custom's been Tearing going crazy, yeah. This oh, right. Right there. Yeah. We in there, baby. Right. Yeah, so, we got two slayers in semis. Yeah. On winner side. Are we side. gonna get two Vikings? Yeah. Oh god. That's the question. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> or are we gonna get a Johnny? Yeah. And it's, it's super nice to see Effortless back. I never Absolutely. thought I would say that about a Johnny player, but you know, <laughs> Look, he, we want to make sure we got that matchup represented. He's been grinding on that play lately. Yeah. It's been in this and in Strive, actually. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. Never stopped the grind for Strive, so it's great to see him back. Like, yeah. Legitimately. So it'll be interesting. So. And like, holy shit, man. Like, we, we saw him on net play last weekend. We yeah. saw him grinding a little bit, you know, during the week. He, he has not missed a beat. No, he hasn't. He is, there, there is no hesitation. There's no rust. Like, still very in there, when, you know? When, like, you think of how effortless plays, he is extremely positive. He knows the game yeah. extremely well. So yeah. it's really hard to lose that kind of stuff. Like, you might be like, oh, I should have done this instead of that. Yeah. But it's hard to be like, oh... I don't recognize the situation. Exactly. The hands, they you know, they might get a little rusty. It might take a little longer to recognize the situation. But as long as you've got the knowledge, and this this dude has the knowledge, Absolutely. right? He knows how to play these matchups. Nice oh, throw. my God. But the throw from Aether And Aether Beat has also been taking a lot of names. Yeah. Uh, took out Takanasi. North Carolina number one best friend. Is he going to take out another top tier? That's the question. Yeah. It's been it's been super dope to see Aether Beat. Hey, peace out, Marlon Pie. Thanks for coming through. Yeah. Uh, oh my god, look at these corner loops, the reset, oh, gets blocked by Effortless. No, doesn't get the coin on that yeah. knockdown. So the hard part is going to be like, I feel like both of these players have played the matchup, but with different people. Yeah. And that's going to be the interesting part, because I think uh, Red is extremely aggressive. It's going to be a little less so, mm -hmm. and that's going to um, that's gonna be interesting. And uh, also on the other Ooh. end, uh, Effortless is very aggressive, but he's very aggressive at really, like, uh, He's, he's calculated exactly. about it. Yeah, he's not. He's not going in just to go in. Ooh. Absolutely. He he goes in when he can smell like your fears. Yeah. Um, 
And it's a little different than like, uh, obviously, uh, you know, our boy Zwei. Mm -hmm. Zwei is extremely aggressive and it pays off for him really well. Yeah. But uh, it's going to be some getting used to for both these players. But the first oh, one going to effortless. Yeah, f and clawing that back that from that one too. Like Aetherbeat had a strong lead in round Absolutely. one. But Johnny right. can erase that shit. Okay, yeah. So there we go. So the IBs, um, 5k challenge. This will be interesting. So like Aetherbeat is definitely uh, a fan of going for a zombie after a punishable situation. That mm -hmm. one wasn't so because it was... Nice. Like, the I air attacking to the throw. Oh, we All right. Burst. Makes Effortless spend the burst. And so, Aetherbeat's burst about to come back. Gets the wake up uh, throw. This is going to be huge. So what is he going to do? Oh, oh he's no. Throw. Reaction to the Suzeron. Yep. That is not enough. The king. Oh, all right. So Tommy. Okay, so this is the scary part. Is yep. Um, Johnny's carded up. He's got his He's carded up, it. and uh, he's a grappler at this point. So all let's right. see what happens. Yeah, big resources on deck for both players. Uh, this is why wire C. Yeah, oh, that's the burst. And yeah, it's burst it. and it's always so freaking hard yeah. to burst Johnny. Yeah, it's hard to burst Johnny. Effortless did a great call in going for the YYRC there because that was the most stable yeah. next play. You know, it's like when both sides got, are, have loaded guns, right? right exactly. You want the thing that's just going to make sure their gun doesn't go off. Right. All right, Johnny already okay, now, up. Now you see he's getting really aggressive now, so. Yeah. Well, he, he already has the game advantage. He's got the coins. He's got A to be backed up in the corner. Big damage here. Okay, here's a knockdown. Oh, no. So yeah, so obviously I don't think we're gonna see any box side like uh, um, unblockables in this yeah. matchup because of how good. Because uh, Azami, yeah. yeah, exactly. So uh, level three is still massive. Ooh, oh, the, the laser. The that should be enough, right? Yeah. Yep. All right. That's the perfect. On All right. Point. Yep. Either beat putting a good fight here. Brett has talked about how tricky this matchup can yeah. be, though, because. There are situations where Biken will have to commit on a hard commit on a Zami, and Johnny can just kind of sit there and wait for it. Yeah. You know? Nice, get the Caesar on throw. Ooh. I wonder what he is mashing there on wake up. Oh, oh the burst the whips. Burst. If well, A to B can seal this round, then it'll be a... It'll be a really yeah. huge advantage, but uh, it's easier said than done, right? Like, right now, yeah. the pressure... Oh, the tackle. throw check! Oh! <laughs> Yeah, bend okay, a little early. Looks like that was probably going to be like a throw attempt. Oh, no. Oh, no. Go. And now he's coined up. Yep. Johnny in level one is a dramatically different character from level two and level yep, three Johnny. Yeah, and here we go. All right, A to B okay. with, the, with the burst, trying to stay alive here. This is huge, actually. Oh, nice. Big is on me on this line. Goes, Goes low. low. Okay. That's not going to kill, but it's going to be level three. So A to B got to be real oh, careful. Oh, nice. big counter hit, but he misses oh, the follow no. up. Kamari. And the dash up throw. Should this should be enough. Be enough. Level three, <laughs> yes. yep. Yeah, and doesn't, he doesn't even need it. Even need it. And right. effortless seals his uh, his ticket. Coffee. Punches his ticket. Yeah. Punches his ticket. Spend, to he bought his ticket. He bought his there ticket. we go. Yeah. yeah. He's, he's, he's just throwing those coins in the Bart machine. Exactly. You know what I mean? Okay. All right. So that'll give us our top eight winner uh, side. Winner side. Yes. We got custom versus effortless on one side of the bracket. On the other side, we got Day Mendo versus hype for sliced bread. And then on loser side, we're still waiting to see the results of a couple matches. So we got either beat versus a landline and Babalu versus the Uh the to winner play right now on stream or what? Um, I mean, I think we might as well. Well, hmm, what do you think? I'm good either way. If we want to hold it so that we can get all top eight started at once, it's fine. Um, but we could also, I think Babalu and Takanasi yeah, already started exactly. their match. So this is the last match. All right, yeah, why don't you just go ahead and run that real quick then. Okay, you want us on stream or what? Yeah, sure. Okay. Either beat. Damien. 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 You're playing. You lose this match. All right. So we got we got Babalu and Bondurin playing off stream. What's up? I ain't telling people to come. I am giving people. It's that open mic commentary. You know how it goes. 
So I'm curious, since, since while we're waiting for the next match to, to, to get started, I've mostly seen you playing Strider for the last couple months. Have you been keeping Exert up like on the side, of, other than like the recent streams you've been doing? Uh, no, just the recent streams I've yeah. been doing is like the me just trying to warm up for this mainly. Yep. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, it's, it's dope to have you here. I, I, I am. Not gonna lie, I am kind of shook at how well the Johnny has stayed preserved. You know, it's like it, it, like you just took it out of the glass case. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's like it's like it's all in the hand still, mm -hmm. but yep. it's like it's like this game is is brutal when it comes to like mem memorizing yeah. like certain things. Mm -hmm. It's like if if you don't have it like on deck, mm -hmm. you will just get washed. Yep. You know, so it's like. It's just like a like wake up call a little bit like man. Oh yeah, this game you. fighting games are hard. Yeah. You fighting, know, <laughs> fighting games are hard, and then when you try and play multiple fighting games, <laughs> it's even harder. Yeah, 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 for sure. Oh man, is there is there any cross pollination between your Nago and your Johnny? And they both got big swords. I guess they got that going. Yeah, pretty much. You know, not not really <laughs> to be honest. Not really. I know. I, I tried. Yeah. I try to play them like Johnny a little bit, yeah. but it's. You might as well just go ham with that character, yep. honestly. Yep. <laughs> All right, Aaron immediately jumping in, gets the JS, nothing else. Counter hit on Aether Beat time. Oh my god, the late jump in forces Aether Beat to burst. Yeah, early burst. All right, oh, and the unblockable right out of shotgun. Stance. Try to zombie out of there, but no. Yeah, Aaron was ready for that shit. All right, shotgun loops, drops it, keeps Aether Beat in the corner. Right, let that time berry go off and again be unblockable. <laughs> <laughs> it's tough. Get There's so many things to look for in defense here. Alright, uh, here we go. Okay. Spend right. meter. Get off me. Wake up super. YRC. Oh, doesn't even get the throw, but he continues. Oh, we got pizza. Starsky, go. Give me the. Give me, give me the. No, no. Starsky. Starsky. Give me the keyboard and then go get pizza. <laughs> Okay, gets the throw. Oh, Ooh. big 6H counter hit. All right, Aaron securing that round one and then blowing himself up immediately afterwards. Okay, here we go. Pressure. Yo, he got, he got a Bro, get the piece. Goddamn. All right, Starsky out here. Refusing to eat the pizza that he's providing, <laughs> even though we got it from the fancy place nearby, because he's making his own later. That's what's up. Oh, nice. Oh my god, throws nice. the tech. Yeah. Oh, nice blitz. You know what's funny? I don't think I've ever actually blitzed Gilzansen, actually, <laughs> thinking about it myself. I think I've always just gotten just opened up yeah. for some reason. I swear to god, I was I was like mashing netplay games with bread last week. I think you you were in that lobby too. And like I got hit by Ozansen 14 times. <laughs> On the 15th time, I stand block it. He goes low. I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, it's like he knows somehow. So them, them, them young child. He's like, I know you know. Yeah. So yeah, I got you. Oh, all right. The counter hit out of the Azami follow up. Gonna put Aaron in the corner. T text backwards. Oh, <laughs> and, and Ada just his fucking shot. I would tell you. Okay. All okay. Right. First. Aether is going in right now. Yeah. Hitting those dust loops. Can we get a knockdown here? No. Nope. Yeah. Goes for the reset. Doesn't get it. And Aaron with the throw. Oh, good. Aether be jumping out of that, yeah, that, uh, really that unblockable. And then getting the punish. Game one goes to Aether Beat. I noticed that's something that Viking kind of struggles with is like sometimes she doesn't really get knocked down on a lot of hits sometimes, actually. Mm -hmm. But like, if you don't play Viking, you, you might not even realize it. So like, you're getting comboed. But yeah. like, it would be helpful if you knew like, oh, he actually can't knock me down. Right. So he has to go for some some greedy reset or something. You know? Yep. Yeah. It's a. Uh, I, I don't even find. I don't think that getting knocked down by her is that scary anyway. Like, I almost think of air tech situations as a bit more scary because I'm so used to being able to mash air buttons, <laughs> and with her, I'll just get caught by, in, by a zombie <laughs> and a counter hit and fucking murder. All right. Oh, Aaron hits the 5D, doesn't finish the combo. And Aether Beat blocks the next one. Oh, the shot. Get shot. Okay, JS, uh, JD to put Aaron in the corner. 
Oh, and Gazan trying to open him up. Doesn't get the full extension, but it'll keep him in the corner. Yeah. Excellent positioning from A to B. Gets the throw. Oh, no. It's not going to kill, though. Oh, oh, no. Barely dropping that dust loop, I think. Okay. All right. Oh, yeah. nice throw. Won't be able to finish off this. He doesn't RC it, but continuing the pressure. Wow. Nice yeah, seriously. Oh, oh, chasing with the Azami. That's a, that's audacious. <laughs> I thought that was an air throw. And this is for Azami? Okay. All right, it'll be here on set point. He's left a string of upsets in his wake so far. Yeah. All right. Okay, opened up by the 16. Doesn't get the follow up. And the unblockable oh, shotgun stance works. Oh, wow. That's so privileged. Oh, the mash. <laughs> Yeah, imagine just being able to hold two buttons to get I that. Know, I know, right? I was just like, yeah, he's got to hold. Oh, never mind. He doesn't have to hold anything. Yeah. You, you know it's fucked up when a Johnny player saying some shit's privileged, too. <laughs> <laughs> Johnny and Naga, actually. Jesus Christ, man. I don't know if I'm allowed to have you at this venue. All right. Hey. <laughs> oh, the blow up. Dang, I just pick Monday. characters I like. That's all I have to say. <laughs> and, what, and what I really like is... And right. what I really like is the win, yeah. okay? <laughs> right, say it with your chest, baby. All right, tying it up. Aaron fighting back here. And the, the Twitch chat coming in big for A to B. Imagine moving for Viking. Okay. Okay, you got knocked down. Oh, the 6P. Oh, nice is on me. And he actually detonates the Prime Berry and it fucks up his combo. Okay. It's funny, that primary explosion is supposed to be like a bad thing, but usually it'll just give you a worse combo. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, we nerfed her, fellas. Yeah. <laughs> Take this. You're good now, right? <laughs> oh, all right, hits the fuzzy. Tech buttons works out for Aaron, though. Aaron with the life lead. Can't quite finish off the JDYRC, though. Oh, my God. I think that's, that YRC stuff is air throw attempt. Oh, all right, we're playing Duck Hunt. <laughs> the 5K connects, A to B out here. All right. Oh. Yeah, it collided. Tech oh. buttons. Tech buttons. Ah, uh, Guilty Gear. All right, time to get married, Viking. <laughs> all right, 1-1. One, one. Aaron taking a second to breathe, to drink some water. A to B also, deep breath in, deep breath out. Highly recommend it. Okay, oh. Oh man, that's 2H under the 5H. All right, Kamari. Oh, close ass. No one really getting anything off these hits, though. No conversion quite yet. Big 6 P. The, oh, and the oh. Kamari reset forces Aaron to burst. It always hurts when you get caught by that air Kabari. Yeah. You're like, oh, crap. Yep. It's, it's pretty visceral. Like, most of the time, you don't even see it, right? Yeah. You're, you're just, like, cruising at, like, super jump height, and then, what the fuck is that? It's the only, the only way it would be better is if she just fucking slams you into the ground. That's really tight. <laughs> like a super troll or something. All right. Oh, JDYR sees a god. Okay. Either beat spends the burst. Okay, Aaron being super meticulous with his he's spacing. Super lame right now. He's I not like even, it. and he, he didn't even stick anything out. Like, either beat hit the 6P, but because it kind nice. of didn't counter hit, so he didn't Oh, wow. That's finished. Yep, either beat on set point once again. But Aaron about to get his burst back. He'll, that, he'll have that soon going around, too. <laughs> oh, all right. Uh oh. Uh, the real ambiguous air situation works out for either beat. Oh, the two A's beat the counter. Yeah, that was unexpected. Okay, the throw. Oh, just run up 6P, but A to B jumps out and doesn't get that meaty. JDYRC enforcing that space and control. There you go, get out of there. Uh, Excellent oh zombie God. from A to B. Anti, yeah. anti airing. This game's got layers to it. Ooh. Oh my god, that was clutch. <laughs> that, that kind of shit? <laughs> that kind of shit is because half of NorCal switched to hitbox. <laughs> oh, run.
one up bait the super. We're good, we're good, we're he good. doesn't have the meter. Oh, just barely gets okay. the punish at the edge of 5H. We got something. Oh, he was looking for the counter, I think. Oh, big JS. Oh, oh no. That's going to do a great. That'll be it. Yeah. Aether Jump beat. H starter. Ooh. Aether beat punching his ticket to top eight loser side. And that gives us our top eight. Excellent job, y'all. All right. Aaron, you want to sit on commentary? You want to match, call matches? I'll get you some pizza. What do you want to do? You want to sit on commentary? You want to call matches? What do you want to do? Okay, okay. How y'all doing out there? Doing good, doing good. It's been pretty fun so far. I hope you guys are out there enjoying these matches. I love, this is one of the reasons why I love tournament because like you can really enjoy like all skill levels, you know? When you have two players who are evenly matched, it can be some dope stuff going on. Marlon didn't enter Exodus. You know, actually, I have no idea. If he did, he got bodied, that's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> this game be like that. <laughs> All right, so we got Demendo versus Bread. This is going to be. A pretty good match. I think in general, Vikings kind of has an advantage. So, okay, early burst. In the house for this shit. These two were mashing on games last night. Oh, okay. Ooh. Oh, goes low. Oh man. Now, I was talking about this with Brett a little bit, but like both both Brett and Slayer or both Viking and Slayer are, uh, you've got to learn a lot of defense, you know? Yeah. That's how you get your your openings. That's how you get a lot of your opportunities. Oh, no. Watch oh, your legs. Overhead. Yo, he is taking a lot of turns right now. Yep. <laughs> Stop him. I mean, I've been there before too, right? You're just waiting like, okay, I don't have the right answer now, but maybe not now. <laughs> All right. Back to neutral. The Amanda taking that round one. Okay, gets the throw. Oh, okay. We got some. We got some anti biking stuff. Yep. I see. Okay, RC. Okay, yeah. He's got one chance, and he's got bar, so he's, he's looking good, even though the life deficit is so bad. Oh, Ooh. and the throw. Okay, he still has the the right of 50 meter, and Damon Dunn doesn't have burst. I don't think he can get a hard knockdown here. Ooh. Oh, we got throw. No fear. Oh, it's so tricky. Ooh. Yeah. So and this, this is obviously, like, we know this because we've seen plenty of player <laughs> and plenty of biking today. But this is explosive on both sides, right? Like, even, you'll see, you'll see me try and throw bread. I get the throw. I get, like, a shitty knockdown afterwards. It's whatever. Slayer hits that command throw. You just gave this motherfucker life. He's got a free <laughs> counter hit on his next special. And you got to mash out. Bread's playing on pad. You know how hard it is to mash out of Slayer's stagger on pad? Oh, no. Yeah. That's cheap, actually. Woo. Okay. Get some pressure going. Damn no trying to, trying to get up out of there. Yep. Okay. Okay, poke out from Damon, though. Ooh. Oh! Nice I, I've, I've gotten walk-up thrown by Peter so many times. 
Reggie's, Reggie's touching. Oh, nice. Right, good job holding that. Oh, wow. Yeah. I didn't see him get out of the game. Nice car. escape by Dame Endo. Yeah. Oh, my oh, God. My and the, <laughs> the cold burst. Holy I want to say he didn't mean to do that, but But you can never out. be sure. <laughs> you can never be sure. <laughs> oh, all right. The RC nice. gets the throw. And the throw again. Bro. Goes low like and gets super. chop, chop, That's not going to kill, though. No. And I don't think he gets, like, real good OK. Oh, but he's in the corner already, though. Yeah, he's going to get oh, that eye that Tommy pressure. Oh. I'm, I like that wire. Can he get a he's down to Oh, he's got yes. super on deck. Oh, he's 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 dead. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. Okay. I'm bred with a round on the he's board. He's dead. He's dead. Stole that shit back. Yo, Vikings got 50 meter, and you have like one guess. Yeah. You're dead. You're dead. Bro. <laughs> You're dead. Oh, hold. Oh, Good excellent block. jump out too. And then he gets the 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 crouching. Confirm off that. All right. Azami's out. Okay, nice knockdown. Oh, doesn't get the right Kabari follow up. Oh, chases him down. Oh, my God. Yo, goodness. the Yo, layers. They are scrambling shit. right yeah. now. Option after option. Oh, the JH hits. Oh, it. oh my God. Let's go. Let's go. All right. <laughs> Tying it up one to one. Let's go. That was sick. Yeah, that was that was <laughs> right? that you was got sick. You, you got to see a completely different bike in that game too. And like the, the the layers of interactions here is not something that we would have seen early in the tournament, you know? Yeah. This this game is so much going on. All right. Early round start advantage for Red. Nice dash through, not trying to hold shit on that season. Oh, the six H counter hit. Yeah, that four dash is uh definitely something Red needs to look out for. Yeah. Oh, like that. All right, a little bit of delayed TK there, fishing for the Azami or something. Oh, power oh, bunker hits, hit. gets the wall stick, blocks the burst, that's huge. Okay. All right, it should be out, yeah. Whoa, no, attack. Text the throat. Brett does that shit a lot. Oh, no. Oh, there it is. Yeah, the hole on the counter. Yeah, but the wake up throw in the RC is enough to put Damendo on set point. The hold on the counter tilts me every time. Yep. It is the one time that I would ask for like a, a, a three, third strike style command throw. You know what I mean? <laughs> Just to make sure you don't get the shit you don't want. It. All right. Oh. Okay. Get the, the corner yeah. advantage here. It's not going to do any damage though. Nice back dash. Okay. Woo. Damon knows. Trying to get up out of there. Chases him down with the air throw. Oh, oh nice flip. Nice and he'll get to take his turn oh, after man. that, converts. Bikes Doesn't get to keep the Oki, though. Yeah, Vikings got 50 meter. Yeah. The Blitz! Overhead to beat the Blitz, but okay, yeah. blocks the burst! There you go. Nice throw. Right, Fred setting up dash. here. Again oh, gets crossed up. Again. He's not dead yet. Yeah. Oh! Uh, All right. <laughs> Aaron popping off <laughs> on Damendo's behalf. <laughs> Shouts to Fred. He will fight it out from here in loser's bracket. And next up, I believe we're going to run uh, Effortless versus Custom, right? Yeah, someone get Custom for me. That's who we got next. Yeah. All right. I'm going to get Custom. Or oh, wait. Yo. Uh. Custom was here the whole time. He feels the energy coming through from stream chat. All those custom homies, mash whatever your favorite emote is. Does custom even have emotes? I don't know. All right. Oh, let me get let me get the bets and shit real quick. Sorry about that. God damn. Peter was the five to one underdog in terms of bets. What are y'all smoking on that shit? Give me some. All right, this is our, our second winner side. Top four, top eight match. Get those bets in, baby. There you are, baby. Hey, Bonjour. Yeah, 
Effortless, obviously, no stranger to this matchup. We've all played Peter plenty of times. We, we got a lot of Slayers out here in NorCal. I wouldn't be, I wouldn't be surprised if Effortless has actually never played Custom, though. Because I don't think we've seen Custom in the uh, winter side top eight of Cali for, or any of our locals ever. So, except actually, for maybe a... Uh, actually, I think uh, Josh is streaming. Uh, so, Effortless is streaming as a... Couple, last couple of days, I think he streamed a few times, and I think I caught him, uh, I think I saw him playing custom online. Okay. Well, it was custom. It was a NorCal play. Gotcha. Well, that round went real good for Effortless. Round start 2D gets clapped. Oh, okay. Misses the, uh, the Zwei knockdown, so we're back to neutral. Nice. Oh, oh. bet it all in that pile bunker didn't quite pay out, so he had to burst to remain living. Oh, well, living as a vampire is, I guess. All right, gets yep. the knockdown with the one hit line. Wire oh. season wide to keep up the pressure. Yeah, Johnny's love that saga. All right, coined up level three. Wow, no fear. Yep, just do it. Oh, still gets clapped though. Quick game one for effortless. It's nice to see this fine return to form from Effortless. And uh, look, we, we got to make sure we still got a Johnny in the pool, man. Yeah, yeah since, uh, since why I went back, back down to SoCal, yep. As you all may remember from WrestleMania 2021. Okay. All right, again. Bad corner situation. Get the oh blitz, my but then gosh. gets thrown yeah. afterwards, yeah. Yeah, too far to get rejected. There's like... With projectiles, it's like proximity rejects. If you're close enough to get played, yeah. but too far there. Why would be hella good? I will say, effortless. Yeah, he is at level three. He spent almost all of his coins to get there. Nice blitz from effortless. Oh, with the backdash from custom. I'm guessing that was not supposed to be a 5D. Ooh. Oh. All right, get get the hit, and actually managed to engage at a range oh. of the 5H. Too with far, it. actually. Yeah, yeah. Nice dash through to get the throw. Custom. All right, he's gonna get that corner combo. Gets the knockdown, goes high, goes low, bites. Oh, goes for three, another though. one. Oh, oh big six P into the counter hit pile bunker to win this round. Oh, oh yeah. that's rough. Yo, oh, no, the oh it works! Oh, Holy no. shit! In case anyone forgot that custom plays Slayer, Jesus Christ. Dude, that's the second. <laughs> that's the second super I've seen custom yeah. kill someone with for dropping their combo. Because yeah. that first one, Look. that one was versus my brother. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. All right. Oh, the TD. Co oh. Double coined up on a Saturday afternoon. All right, custom spends the burst to keep going. Nice. Good. Uh, All right, he's not going to get. Oh, he <laughs> does get the, the sand stash treasure hunt to get the ascension here. And that will give him two uh, bottles of sunscreen. Ooh. Oh wow, and the finish effortless now on set point. Yep. Nice round start him off. Uh oh. Alright, yeah, effortless stabilizing here with the conversion. Oh! Alright, chasing down. He's hunting out the burst, didn't quite get it, and instead gets thrown. Custom doesn't get the full combo off the RC oh though. My God. And now he's just pointing it out. <laughs> Blitz attack turns around on his track. Oh, counter hit on the CG. Nothing special, but he does get the pass through into oh the fight. Oh my God, Chaos has to spend the burst. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're swinging. Oh, oh, blocks the burst. Not dead yet. Oh, jumps oh out, gets a counter God. hit, lands. All right. He can't kill off of this, but he can't get yeah, a grip of damage. And now you got to see what happens next. The super gets dashed oh, through, 16. and custom takes yep. game two. We tying yeah. it up out here. Johnny, Johnny's reverse super notoriously easy it's finicky, to yeah. uh, to low profile. And we got Sal's in the chat lending his energy to his fellow Slayer. Never forget, baby. Anime is real at Calibers. Oh, ducks that 2D. All right, Josh still chasing him down here, chasing yeah. all the way to the corner. Interesting, just using the transport to chase. Yeah, I mean, Custom wasn't challenging it, right? He's just letting him keep on that string. Okay, gets the knockdown off the Zwei, so he's gonna Zwei wire C to get right back in there. Ooh. 
Oh, and the overhead off his finer. Everyone gets hit by the that. The coming in to root for the Donnie. Gotta yep. show the <laughs> cat heavily biased towards Custom right now. So, gotta get some love on the yep. other side. <laughs> it's the thought that counts, right? You, you know when you're the away team. You know, you know, you know what you signed up for. Yeah, that Johnny 6 8 is like is a huge fun, but it's like very oh. low on active frame. So with Slayer's ability to like back dash and like candy stuff having inbound is oh pretty my good what shot of dodging it. Alright. Really good situation for Everless. Yep. Looking real good here. That's oh. it. And effortless. Yeah. Now, now we got effortless up here in winners finals. That was a we run really back. good effort by Custom. Custom's run has been really good so yeah. far. Yeah, and it, that was winner side, so he's still in it. Oh. All right, uh, Starsky, can you open up the bracket real quick? Hey, Starsky, can you open up the bracket real quick? All right, so that gives us uh, Daymendo versus effortless in uh, winners finals. We still got losers to run, so. Let's see what our losers quarters, or let's see our losers round six looks like. We got Nuclear Papaya versus Aetherbeat and Babalu versus me. Let's do, uh, let's do Wilton and Aetherbeat up next. Wilton, get Aetherbeat. Yo, where's Damien? Someone get Damien. Swear to God, y'all. Someone get him? He eating pizza right now? Is that what's cool? I want some pizza. <laughs> All right, fuck it. I'm going to get him myself. Well, get your pizza before your match. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I'm good. All right, so I guess for now, I am solo commentary until Pat gets back with his pizza, maybe. Um, yeah, we have a, uh, <coughs> I'll move over. We have Aetherbeat versus Nuclear Papaya. So Aetherbeat, you've seen a couple of times, Viking player, getting pretty strong these days. Um, Nuclear Papaya is a Ram slash Eno player. Uh, long time Ram player, but used to play Eno, has been like basically toying with like playing Eno again as main. Um, my guess is he will pick, you know, in this one because uh, I think he favors that matchup more. All right. Yep, favor for the, you know. Doing some protective Tommy. Note. Oh, nice follow up. Yep, back dash is going to do it like that. Ooh, nice. Yep, Zombie's paying out so far for uh, either beat. Wow, rare, rare footage of Eno actually doing sick ass. There's a normal they added in like Rev 2 or 2.1 or something. Uh, not very often seen. It's not that great. Oh, nice air throw. Tech trap right there. You know, take that reset. Get out. All right, life totals. Oh, we're going for the mix. Not too much damage, though. VCL stuff. Oh, my God. Goes for the sterilization, but doesn't get punished because they actually commit to the zombie. Not dead yet. Oh, yep. Gets clipped in the toes. Yeah. I think because the FD is there. I think a far slash QH is like a four frame gap, so I think you, you might just be able to jump out give a three frame jump, but it might hit high enough. All right, note stuff. Oh my God, Sakura auto correct. Oh, burst the right away. I'm gonna deal with any of this Eno stuff. Yep, VCL, YRC to be safe. Wow, the, the soccer timing is, uh, or the stroke timing is a little bit unfortunate here because if you time it well, you can actually low profile under the soccer, but 
right now. Do a little bit early. All right. Nuclear fire takes another round or takes a round. Hey, what's up? Shout out to what's up, Winter Showdown. Thanks for checking out the stream. All right. Oh, gets him with the reset. Yep, you gotta watch out. Looking really good for either beat. Oh, throw it in the corner. All right, mix up city. Good dead angle. Let's go handle or deal with any of that mix. Yep, more come to get out of there. Wow, nice conversion off the counter hit. Pretty big life lead for uh, either beat. You can probably have work to do, but if anyone can do it, you know can. 6P, but Joe Capo's too late to get the confirm. What's the mix? Oh, boy, good block on the triangle dash. Oh my god. That should be it. Yep, first game goes to Aetherbeat. Aetherbeat, pretty good run so far today. Heavy day is, is a classic. <laughs> I, I think I do prefer to, but I, I won't compete or won't put him in the competition. Oh, not I being the Kabaris. You gotta watch out. If you don't IB, it's like plus two or something. It's, plus enough that Viking gets to take a turn, so you gotta IB it and we force her to play a mind game around that. Nice stroke. Oh my god. Oh! That's the that's the issue with you know if you're not matching against you know she's just gonna hover dash at you forever. Oh, juicy counter gets really lucky with that burst. That burst was so scary. He's out of range, but either beat actually extended a limb and uh, got hit. Nice back dash. Dodges the uh, local Soji, I think. I forget which one's called. Oh my god, the sockets have been working out. Nice, eight strokes. Oh, misses a triangle dash, but not too, doesn't pay for it. Oh, counter hit. But no knockdown, too far. One of the problems with Eno, she's too far and they're not uh, standing, you can't get a knockdown. 2D does not have good range. Yep, either beat noticing that uh, Nukify is not I being though he's pressing, taking his plus turn. Nice. Big combo? Nope. Either be has a full stick of butter though. This is very scary. You gotta be wearing any super attempt. Nice, wow. Is he dead? Can't. Oh no, goes. Tries to hustle. Uh, Tries to play the tech throw game too much, but either beat does a pretty good delay tech there and uh, throws. Nice. That OS. First right away, there's only two that can meet them. It's an okay trade, you take that as you know. Rare, rare footage of something trading like advantageously again. To Tommy, usually Spike and loves the Tommy trade. Okay, first gone on both sides. Oh, big damage! Not a ton of damage. More Komi. No. All right, very precarious right here. Oh, goes to the throw. That's not enough though. One more chance for either beat. Oh no, thrown in the corner. Is it? Oh man, Aether be playing so clutch today. God damn, on a tear. <laughs> Man, that was good shit though. Aetherby is playing really well today. He took me out, or he took me to losers. He took out Landline, and he took out uh, um, 
nuclear fire. Took out me, my brother, and my brother's roommate. <laughs> a college roommate. All right, we got a uh, Babylon versus Pat. This is the. This is a. Uh, I think whoever whoever wins this moves on to, or whoever loses is out of seven. Are you are you doing brackets too or no? Or someone else doing brackets? Yeah. Uh, you should update. I think also AF was two one as well. one just the last crew here so this is losers quarters i believe right? yes, yeah. yes yeah so where of this i think plays there to be uh no i think they play the loser of um i think they play they play custom i think oh okay okay yeah, yeah. okay so okay so we're at the start of top eight so cool. yeah 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 this is the start of the loser side like start of top eight all right, that was going for Faust. He told me that he likes this matchup. Yeah, I, I I know he likes this matchup a lot more. I think the the thing is is Faust is really strong in the scramble matchups. So like he can scramble, still play within himself, and get way better reward He's than anybody could. He's getting mixed right now though. Yeah. He getting uh. shipped on. Also, JH massive fun. Day JD really good against. Uh, yeah, let's character. see if uh, that looks get started this time. That time, basically, that got the hit early on and just ran Ooh. it. So always, people. Uh, oh, when you're nice. when you're like learning to fight against Faust, you don't actually want to go for the food unless you desperately have to, because he can't throw another item when the food is out. There's yeah. rules to the item throws, so yeah. got to be careful there. Um, All right, throwing the oil. Yep. Can find a good way to ignite it. Nice. Probably not. Yeah. Okay. Oh no. Uh, he's probably gonna super, yep. That mix is on point right now. Just a bunch of hammers and one firework. Yeah, and one donut too, so that that may come into play. Oh no. Not down? Not dead. What's this mix though? Oh my god, we just teleport! You know what I respect you. He had the RC to put the meter make a You know what man? Oh JD don't care. Oh my god. This That's gonna be enough. OTG, oh, yeah. OTG. Alright. So the one thing, um, uh, about this matchup that's playing is that like generally speaking Faust really struggles with like characters that just get in his face right because he doesn't have a really good mash button but because Chip spends so much time in the air like that's where he, his like buttons are way right. superior to most characters right so like that was committing to the Faust pick yeah I think this is the right thing I think honestly um he doesn't want to play in the frame. Like, it's the same way when he played against Slayer, right? Like, he didn't want, he does not want to play Faust into those. And Babalu has said that he wants his two characters to be, like... Complementary. Complementary, exactly. Right. So, like, the Cover matchup spread. Matchup. Exactly. All right. Ooh, nice challenge. Not so much damage, though. All right, Mini Faust is the boy. He will always... Yeah, even if Faust gets him. hit, it doesn't matter. Yeah. Oh, JD. Yeah, see, there he was. See, he was still chilling, yeah. still lurking. Yeah. Here we go. Okay. All right. Black Gravity? hole. Oh, this is actually. What the hell? Yeah, black hole is actually kind of funny. Also, like scalpel, he doesn't have like I don't think he has a lower half strength scalpel. Nice challenge. Yeah. Oh my God. The yeah, teleport. and that's gonna be a lot of damage. No knockdown. But. All right, Pat just immediately giving him the. Oh wow. What a gamma trade. Just immediately letting him uh, be free. Oh. Okay. Oh no. Damn, I, I right, can't right. imagine what he pressed. Oh, Mephouse right there! Mini nice Faust. Gamma. Oh, oh okay, yeah. you can't teleport. Yep. 
Yeah, the problem is that that YRC. Yeah, exactly. I think if he didn't YRC, he might that might have been able to teleport out in time. Okay, so this is set point for Pat. Um, not an easy path for either of these players. And right now, it's looking like Pat just he's got it, man. Yeah. Okay. Oh, good tech from Babalu. Here we go. We got the mini pass. And Mini Pass is one of the items where he can throw another item while he's on the screen. Oh no, do I? Oh yeah, so so he's been doing a really good job of like, uh, when you block, going my way, you can like steer it, right? right. Um, but if it just whips like that, you're, yeah, you're, you're gonna get punished. Scared. Exactly. Uh oh, oh. alright. It makes, it's a hundred meter. Nice. Good block. So okay. another he's gonna meter. need, oh, that's it. And Pat the flip will move on to play custom? I think so. Yeah. 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 Okay. Yep. Custom. Okay. So Aether B is. <laughs> this is what you guys deserve. Bring on the Bikins. Bring us the Bikins. Where is Bread and where is Aether B? Where's Bread? They deserve yeah. each other. Once again, the really good run by Aether B yeah. today. Yeah. Like sure. Putting in work. Like yeah. and showing that his like his you know his time put into the game. Absolutely, that's exactly what we love to see. And like Aetherbeam is always streaming yep. this game every week. You know? He's always game, opening the lobby, doing commentary, doing a lot of community exactly. work. Too. Yeah. So love to see someone like that succeed. You know, someone who puts their time and effort and yeah. sweat into the community. And and it's the same for Brett too. Like these two are like if you kind of troll around Twitch, Rev Two, you see these two streaming all the time. And they're both pretty young. So the next generation of Rev 2 players are looking pretty good right now. Yep. Um, but I just, I just, I just am going to say they deserve whatever happens to them in this matchup. Both of them <laughs> deserve exactly what happens to them in this matchup. Yep. yep. Um, Look, man, if you can't, if you can't face the mirror. Exactly. Like, you, you need to understand what you do to other people. Exactly. Right? So these two both, I think I've seen them play pretty consistently in that play. Um, Generally speaking, bread it, uh, does better just because bread. I think it's more seasoned. But um, in a first to two, anything can happen, right? I love the screen glitch out. Yeah. So I mean, this just happens with the stream, unfortunately. Yeah. yeah, yeah. But uh, everything is fine once. Yeah, yeah exactly. So one of these days, we're gonna figure it out. Like I, I think my favorite line Pat had early on was, "This is the level of production. Like he doesn't want to put effort, so people don't have expectations for production value." So he's like, yeah, this is what it's going to look like, and if you expect any better, you shouldn't. Uh, all right, this is the first to two. So, Red coming all the way up from SoCal. Yep. Depis Smack versus the Carpool from Hell. I think the remaining Carpool from yeah. Hell, because it was him and Paradine today. Paradine and, yeah, it was just those two. So then the other ones are like obviously Jack. So, Red versus Blue. Yeah, Red versus Blue, <laughs> so here we go. <laughs> All right, so bread. I think bread is um, pretty comfortable being the aggressor in any mm. matchup, especially this one. Right? Like it's gonna be interesting. Yeah, to see. Right now, bread is really absolutely what a six P. Right, and bread like consistently tops or wins Rev Tuesday. Right. Yep. So this is like I don't know if this is like first like. Offline, but I mean, you know, this is this might be one of the bigger offline yeah. tournaments that he's ever participated in. Offline, sure. different too, you know, like especially Absolutely. if you're like if you're not playing, you're probably playing on PC. Like, yeah, you know, it's pretty different from playing on PS. And look at like the the damage difference already for A to B versus spread. Like this is like you know the the character does a lot of damage. The character also doesn't have like the the highest health. All right, Bird, bring it back though. Now actually, oh, has dude, oh no, that's a no punish too hard though. It's not the worst thing. Yeah, but he's still in the corner and he's at the meter disadvantage. Meter disadvantage. And we not know Brad. Oh, oh what? Whoa! What the hell? Yo, boss, my weight. Yeah. Dude. <laughs> oh, nice. Okay. Nice All right. Oh, yeah, so Zombie eating the... Oh, that sucks so much. He, he just wanted to throw. He did the right thing. What the... F Whatever. Out of range, baby. All right, you know what? I said... I stand by what I said before. Whatever happens to you, you deserve it. You do this to other people. 
how it is. Okay, it's bold. <laughs> Better make sure you're in throw range. Yeah. Alright. Nice. Okay. Okay. Nice damage. Look at that. Woo. Wrist. Wrist is really oh, strong. Wow. A tiny bit of wrist does a lot of damage because the way it works right. is that uh, when you hit someone and there's wrist, it subtracts the amount based on your attack. And as long as your wrist is over zero, the combo doesn't start scaling. Right. And it starts scaling like, you know. Yeah, it, it goes down to like meter. Two, right? yeah. It doesn't immediately jump to like whatever number of hits. Right. So like, wrist increases your damage. Crazy like drastically, though. exactly. Okay, so right now, Brett again. Like Brett, I, I, I think the difference right now oh, is no. Brett is consistently setting the tone and then able to kind of steal it back from Aether V. Yeah. Um, and that's just his, his look, he, we knew the, yeah. that Brett was the best Viking in the West. I think like, one of the underrated things about Viking is her ability to like lock you down in the corner and Brett is showing yeah, like, absolutely. how good this character can be at that. What is like, God's even name Aether V, like another Viking is not oh, able to what's escape. The same? Okay. But no, now now Aether V's running in. I can't believe he burst it. Like that is such a scary point to burst off. Oh no, now you Those young gone. man reactions, bro. Oh, that was dirty. Happy little reset. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> okay, okay. Aether V, fight back. Oh no, the leg kick. Yo! Yo. That should be it. Okay. Nice. Okay. Aether V around. Aether V staying alive. Remember, this is still just uh, best of three. Yeah, exactly. So, Brett is still on set point right now. So, this is scary. Nice. Ooh, what a Mizrami. Nice. Uh -huh. Oh, oh all right. It's a beast. Feeling it. I love that. You got anti zombie setup too. I feeling it, it, Mr. Krabs? Are we feeling it? That's the burst. Oh, no. Oh, not this crab. All right. Come back. You better watch out. What, what a throw. throw. Throws the 6K before it goes strike in bowl. Yeah, or that's throw one. Sorry. Oh, oh no. no. What? Oh, oh no. no. Brett's definitely going for resets in places that I wouldn't expect either. And that's catching Aether Beast off, off guard. Nice. Oh my god. All right. Aether Beast one up. One, Yo, one, Aether one. Beat. Let's Yo. go. Putting in the work. Rising Star Aether Beast. Yo, Let's send him back to SoCal. Let's go. <laughs> Yo, buy his commentary. Yo. <laughs> It's really like really composed right now, though. I actually really like how uh, well he's playing defense. He's not getting scrambled too hard. Right. Exactly, yeah. Oh. Oh. Nice, nice. Okay. Okay. Yeah, okay. I, I, I was expecting maybe a reset attempt. Oh! oh I hate Afkabari. I hate Kabari, period. Afkabari is really messed up. Jungle Kabari is really good, but there's more counterplay. Yeah. <laughs> we are, oh. oh, my goodness. All right, Brett is. Oh, my Brett God, what a block! Extremely aggressive now. Yeah, the last overhead. Oh, oh, Brett is refusing to give his turn back. Refusing. I'm, wow. To base the. Oh, he super? got crossed up there. Yeah. 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 That's a tricky thing. It's hard to judge when you got momentum like that. Nice, Kabari. <laughs> nice. Good jump out. Yeah, no, that's a good spot. Oh, yeah. that's going to be it. Yeah. All right. Brett's still back up to that point, but it doesn't matter. Look, it's. This is just a start, guys. This is just the beginning. Nice. Ooh, yep. Good Gizami. Oh. Wow! What an air zombie! Air zombie looking pretty good right now. <laughs> yeah, neither, neither player really throwing each other in the air. Yo! They ate, so. Oh, oh no! Oh no! Oh my god! Okay, this is looking really good for Brett now. Damn, what a conversion from Brett. All that meter. Nice. Nice air throw. Dude, a Aether Beat's actually been on points with those, like, air throws. Like, getting people, like, trying to tech trap them. Yeah. Oh, but this is... Is this enough for Brett? No. No, he has all that Not meter, it. though. Oh, here we go. Is it time for the classic from Bonder? Right, he's ready. He's ready. Oh. Oh! Let's right. go, Damien! Let's go. It's what final, final. Sniffed it out. All right. Final round. Oh. Two. Oh, one. my God. Of course we have, we have to have a fucking danger time in the last round.
Hello? Oh, oh what a red is... a zombie. Yo. Luckily for Aether Beat, it was not, it was pretty late in the game. Nice, the patience! Okay. Alright, what's the setup after this? Oh no. Yo, that's gonna be. Close us out. That's it! Aether! Oh, let's, let's, let's go! Let's fucking go! Let's fucking go! Let's fucking go! Yo, Aether Beat defense NorCal? Let's fucking go. Oh my goodness. My the only God. way to kill a biking is to send another biking at them. Oh my, oh my God! And Aether Beat has been playing out of his fucking mind today. Good stuff to him, and good stuff to Brett. Thanks for coming all the way out yeah. here. But uh, you know, today another biking uh, reigns supreme. Now we're back to a. That's a Lovely matchup dude. that everybody loves. Everybody knows and loves this matchup. It's what got us uh, into Guilty Gear, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Certified <laughs> NorCal Classic clip. Yeah, exactly. Um, but yeah, so this is, this is uh, Custom is the other player who's been doing extremely well. Yeah. I think a lot of people would not have expected it. So yeah. Custom was the one who sent Bears to losers, and Pat was yeah. the one who eliminated Bears. Yep. So in a lot of ways, this will be uh, this will be an interesting one. Um, yeah, and we can. Uh, I heard. I definitely heard Jeremy in the background said, "Let's fucking go. Let's go." That NorCal, <laughs> NorCal <laughs> bias. Let's go. Yeah. So this is the for the last spot in top four. So the winner of this will play Aether Beat. Dude, Aether Beat's clutching. Yeah, no, I'm he's still clutching like, out really well. He was just so calm the entire like his entire run. All right, all right. This should be a fun right. match. We see one man chip. <laughs> prepare to die. We got the fucking. My name is Pat the Flip. You killed my father. Prepare to die. <laughs> but he also killed his father. Hey, you know what? You have to do what you have to do. You know what I'm saying? Like, all right. So now it's gonna be one man running around trying to like, you know, like just shank the other one yeah, while exactly. the other just like hits them with a chainsaw or a hammer or something. No, one, so one guy is gonna slap him really hard. The other guy is gonna like stick a grenade down his throat. <laughs> oh my god! I think he did he get crossed up? Maybe. Or was that just, I don't know what Custom was definitely shaking their head like did not know what the hell that was. Okay. That's it's really bad because that's your burst. Yeah, your burst that's start. your burst. Exactly, that's the burst also. Okay, good block. Oh, oh. no, here it goes. Yo, that was new burst? Oh no, this is the dash up. Oh, Super for the knockdown. Yep. Yep. Not enough. Yep. Got. Oh no! You back oh, the back first dash. time. Oh no! And yes, the BDC, the BDC, the BDC was paying off, right? Because he did he had that extra life because of uh, Slayer had that extra life because of bite, the, yeah. the bite the first yeah. time. So bite heal Slayer. It's like <laughs> I always forget that, but it's like yeah, he is a vampire. He does heal from exactly. the bite. Oh no. Oh, oh my what? god, they really dodged Dude, the Pat team. is backdashing at extremely terrifying places. Okay, shake that. Oh! Like, that's the sh the okay, for those counting at home, it's one out of two for Burst Super for Custom in this game so far. And and remember, when we clipped Custom's like, like footage for the fucking show match, it was a bunch of fucking supers. So don't expect different, you know what I mean? Like, know what you're working with. Exactly. Know your audience. <laughs> Slash my tires and stole my wallet. Okay. All right, pretty good round for round. Oh nice. well, my yep. goodness. Yeah, custom showing that he, uh, they have knowledge of the chip uh, matchup. He's got to blitz his uh, mix. Okay. Fortune All right, so, so the one good thing about this is he ha like Slayer had to spend the uh, the burst. The custom is not going to have their burst. There's not going to be a burst dead on time. Oh my nice god. Nice punish from Pat. Oh no. What? Try to go for some That happened again. I. Yo, people are dying off their drops in this tournament. You're dying off their drops. It's late, You got to finish your play. Yeah. I know that feeling because that yeah. happened to me too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Okay, so now. All right, first game. Custom. Yo, are the new blood going to put in work? Yeah, no, it's, it might just be a new blood tournament. Like, winner's side might be 
uh, <laughs> two OGs, but right now, this is what, look, we've done you all love this. To see this. You actually do love to see this. Yeah, so exactly. We did all this for, for, you know, for the community. I'm just going to ignore the fact that Custom basically just wanted to die there, but this is why we put in all this work for Caliburst, for Rev Tuesday, for all the Play Guilty Gear events, we want to see stuff like this. We, like, when we were, like, you know, going into Frosty, we're like, look, you're gonna see some new people. You're gonna see some new names. Ooh. You're gonna see people you didn't expect. That guy's just working. Oh, that was cheap. Oh, nice. Pick Got up. the tip. So, gonna get the full combo here. Get the knockdown. Yep. Nice Obu. What's the next? Oh, yep. Nice. Oh Good my blitz. god, not this time, but. Yeah, because yeah, the, the charge was put him in a uh, weird spot. Okay. Pack in a burst. Doesn't want it. Oh, once again. Nice. Now you again, see me, yeah. now you don't. One needs one more good hit. Yeah. Oh, doesn't make the burr. Yo, still Throw. Have a chance. Nice. Nope. Okay. Far Six. slash. Okay, so Pat ties it up. All right, let's see. Wh let's see where we're going. All right, we're going immediately. Well, fuck it. Fuck it. Let's go. Let's go. Let's get this done. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> All right, immediate burst for custom. Oh my goodness. Oh, the dandy pile bunker. The bane of the existence of a chip player. Oh, guys. Nice. Taking advantage of the fact that Pat blocked the other two last time, so going for the throw. Oh, that was an air in 5D. I don't know what that was supposed to be. Maybe. Nice alpha? Maybe? Oh, oh my nice. Doesn't what the care. hell? Doesn't care. <laughs> the gamma like went cross up. Oh, 6P, baby. Counter hit too. All right. All right, gonna get that knockdown. Oh, no, goes for the No, hit. I think he's trying to get enough of it. I don't think it's enough. Yeah, it's not. Oh, nice. Helpful YRC. You can't see me! Helpful YRC is cheap. It's cheap. All right, here we go. Pat set point, but uh, Custom is going to give him everything it's worth. Not going to back down. Nice. Oh! Okay, not punish too bad for that burst, but... You uh, it's, 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 it's looking kind of bad right now, though. Oh, oh, nice no. air throw on attack. Yeah, it, it looked like Custom was trying to go for the like the tech there, but so maybe. Uh, uh, okay, oh nice. no, he's blitzing him with chip things. Blitz wars? Yep, that's plus. What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> Playing the safe game, I respect okay. it. I, I'm not trying to end up a clip. I was absolutely <laughs> good run though by custom. Befuddled by what I just was that uh, custom is out of fifth. Yeah, I think? out of fifth. But oh my god, <laughs> what the hell? Is that? that was something. I witnessed something. Oh, uh, what's up? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. It's been two years. Yeah. It's been since Anime Ascension 2020. Since these two have played it yeah. offline? Yeah. It's true, huh? It's fucking crazy. Um, it might just be in general. I was talking to Effortless before, and he's like, yeah, I think it's been two years since we played, period. It's crazy. Pandemic, man. Yeah, no. But uh, the top four will be, you know, these two are going to be uh, winners' finals, and then Pat will go on to play Aether Reef, Rising Star. Oh, my goodness. It's crazy. All right. So this is the first three. Our first first of three of the night. Um, these two go way back. You know, you you and I both know. We they played play. forever. Exactly. Well. They were playing each other when I first came to the scene. Right. I, I came to the scene relatively late. Okay. So we're going to get a button check real quick. Okay. Yeah. Um, like, well, I started going to events like late 20s. Summer 2018 or so? I think so, so yeah. Yeah, these guys have been competing with yeah. each other since then, you know. <laughs> like, actually, <laughs> Effortless is one of the first people I lost to in the tournament. Yeah. And, uh, Effortless, of course, uh, was kind of our, 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 our Johnny to, to for look for time, yeah. for a very long time. Well, I kind of took the title for a bit, but, uh, Right now, Everless is kind of reminding people who he is and what he's about, right? Yep. So, all right. So this is just a button check, but uh, these guys have gone back so many times, so many places. Like, you know, we'll see. Uh, but Everless also kind of just recently got gotten back in the online grind. 
Um, yeah, was pretty focused on try for a while. Yeah, exactly. It makes sense. And he's still playing try. Yeah, he is. Yeah. But like you know, I understand that. Like that's the big new game. Absolutely. Right? He's got good net codes. I, I understand. A great character too. But. Uh, Dave Mendo, right. on the other hand, hasn't really been playing as much, but it's like, look, you know, still sharp. Still, you know, still extremely still knowledgeable. Both of these players are the extremely is, knowledgeable. Dave Mendo does a lot of his work in the lab. He yeah. labs defense a lot. I think that's one of the key things that makes him a very strong player. And I think that's what we're going to see with this one, is these two are going to, they're going to take their time. Right. This is like, it's been a while, they got to remember how the other one plays, and these are two of the smarter... And two of the smartest Guilty Gear players like mine, I've like, you know, personally. Right? No. Like, oh, oh my goodness. Yeah. Oh. And, and here's the other thing. When they get the hit, they're going to make it hurt. Yep. All right. Yeah, awkward hit there for... Oh, missed the air throw. Oh, 2D. Oh, what? Wow, that low profile up to 5P, huh? Yeah, that was weird. I, I can see that, actually. Jarn's 5P hits quite high. What a BDC. I'm out of there. I don't want to do with YRC. Oh, no. Gets the one. Yeah, so do get the knockdown. So that's going to be it for day there. So tear up round one. Remember, this is the, since this is winner's final, this is the first to Yeah, absolutely. I love how, like, I'm looking at these betting odds, and, it, like, if you told me however long ago these were the odds we are going to give, <laughs> it's insane. <laughs> Y'all, y'all not believe it in Dave Mendo? Y'all wild. Y'all wild, man. Okay. Oh, oh, the key. oh man. Doesn't punch it too much, though. Yeah. Nice throw. Peter will have you thinking, like, how you, were you ready for something I've literally never done before? <laughs> nice. Okay. Oh, big damage. Keep okay, the coin. Two. We're going to get the, the last one. Nope. Level Just three. Nice three, throw, yep. so this should be enough. Yep. Oh no, oh, both of them blockable. Interesting. Well, I I I kind of like the decision to extend the round a little bit. Because he's, he's trying to build super, a Yeah, he's super behind. Yeah, right. that's true. There's one thing if you're low on like I, I forget if the regeneration comes only if you're low on health though. I don't think so. I think it's just I, I don't know. It's hard to say. I know it's like usually like the dis the time of the. Uh, the match, but I, I don't know if there's specifics to it, so we'll see. Fair enough. It's looking like it, it's going up right Ooh, now. Ooh, nice but. 5k. Yeah, that's really good spacing there. Johnny 5k is really an all-purpose poke, and that's where spacing is really nice there. Okay. Oh, all Bunker City. The what? Uh, yeah, and we're to gonna. Do. Oh, um, bet it on Blitz. No big punish though. Oh my oh, god! That's the punches it. with like the tiniest like that's little leg, <laughs> like little kick of jump ass. Mm -hmm. So one thing I usually notice when we see, so first game goes to the Amanda, but one of the things that I usually see out of Everless is he's really aggressive with the coin when he like wants, wants it. Like, the coin pressure is kind of ridiculous and it does kind of leave him in kind of an awkward situation. Um, but right now, not, not seeing it. Now he's getting aggressive. So one of the, like, the hallmarks about both these players are they're extremely good at adapting on the fly, and they're extremely good at switching the, the pace when they need to. So, right now, look at him. Look at that damage. That's why you play Johnny, baby. Look at that red, big red bar. Oh, no, drops it. Oh, my God. Unblockable. It no. don't even matter. Five gold letters. Okay. All right. Improv. We're improv with <laughs> RCs. It's uh, part of the freedom in here, right? Yeah, exactly. Part of the reason why these top tier characters are so top tier is a lot of times they just get rewards off of um, how well they're able to just scramble and just adapt on the fly. Right. Like, and you know, every character gains a lot of power when that meter. RC is very strong. Right. Oh, oh but this round is all day men though. Good yeah. block. Good block, but okay. Just, just keeping Everless in the corner. Yeah. And it's a quick one too, so it's gonna be a little bit uh, of a wait for Burst to come back. Oh, nice start. Oh, yeah, the classic. Yeah, Donnie specific. JTK pickup. Oh, oh my struggle. Okay. All right, here we go. Good block. Nice block. Oh, caught the back dash. Very good from Dave Mendel. Ooh. Oh, my God. Hunt for the, oh. for the air throw. Didn't get it, but still recovers. 
Nice challenge, guys. But no, yeah, that's the problem. Johnny, as good as he is, if he's not coined up. Yeah, he's not going to get conversions off and stuff yeah, like that. Unless you spend meter or you, you have levels, you're not going to get conversions off and stuff like that. All right. All right, last, last effort. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah, Peter didn't bait the burst, but also didn't come back to bite him because he, he, he was on level two misfinder at that point. So it could have been really bad. All right, right now. They're both taking a second to think about it. Yep, they manned up 2 0. Alright, so. Oof, yeah. Big damage. I, I think we generally feel like Peter gets a lot. When he gets comfortable, it gets really hard to beat him. Like, right. And he's looking really comfortable you have right to now. surprise him in some way. Yeah. But he adapts so fast that you exactly. have to keep rotating what It's you're really, doing. It, it's extremely difficult to beat him in a long set because of that. Like, you might be able to get him in a first or two. Anybody, like, certain characters, it, it's... Oh my god, right what a big six feet. But, oh. All right, not punch too hard there, but this is still a really rough situation. You're Good a block. starter, no oh, meter, no, no burst. Half-life. Oh, more like a third life at this point. Well, we dive in. big. We duck in, we weave in. Oh, Right, enough. A kill. The last chance for Everless. He has to make the comeback from nothing. No meter even. Yeah. Oh my! Oh my Yo, what's the momentum on that 6K? All right, good stuff to Demendo. All right, they will sit in a place that he is all too familiar with. Winner side of Grand Finals yeah. right now. But Everless still alive. We'll play the winner of this match. Yep. We have Pat versus Aetherbeat. Yeah. Will Aetherby continue his ridiculous run? Yeah, that's a good question. Um, in a first to two, anything is possible. This is the last first to two of the night. Um, Pat, of course, sent to losers by uh, Bread. Bread was taken out in the mirror match, so Pat does not get his revenge. But the question is, can he take out another five game? <laughs> and generally speaking, Pat uh, has done pretty solid against the Vikings. Um, uh, it's actually funny, you guys can't see it, but now, like, <laughs> Hemendo and Effortless are just chatting about their match. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, look, they've played for years. Like, <laughs> Are we trying to get the sound up? It, yeah, there's there's graphical glitches during character select, but it'll go away once the game comes in. And luckily, like, on it's not a problem on the player screen. It's just yeah. like some screen capture nonsense. All right, so Pat requesting to get the sound wants no excuses. Yeah, he no, he wants to hear the suzeron. Yeah. All right, yeah. he needs. Yeah. Look, you react, look, in general, I think studies have shown you react faster to sound than visual cues, so I understand. Yeah, Vikings will try to tell you you gotta do it regardless, and it's like, come on, man. Look, that's right, but I'm too used to, like, not having sound in throwing sense, right? right? You just accept that as part of life. Okay. All right, there it is. It didn't help. <laughs> that burst right away doesn't deal with any of that damage. Oh, once again, did not help. Oh, yeah, tips super slow wake up timing. Goes low. All right, here's the question. What's the mix-up? Oh, the mix-up is drop mix. Yeah. Wow, backs off. Yeah, I'm surprised wow. he doesn't go for more. I, I the mid. So the one thing I'm surprised is he doesn't go for more J2Ks because, like, J2Ks can still work out. Pretty well normally for him. Yeah, Gate to Gate is pretty good against a zombie or a zombie, right? Because it has a ton of little hits, and only one a zombie follow-up actually has strike in one, right. which is um, which is soccer. Every other one actually doesn't. So like, oh, goes right through the six P. How rapid say. those hits are! You can actually interrupt the zombie follow-up. Mm -hmm. And Tat's the betting favorite right now. So somebody, whoever the believer in Aether be, could get paid. Okay. Yep, doesn't go for J2K that time either, just the J8 JS, okay. I kind of show in, uh, show in Aether V the, uh, the full deck of cards right now. Nice head throw. Incredibly good. It's the Skullgirls players, man. 
Oh, what a backdash. Okay, reset. Not gonna be able to do anything here. Okay. Darcy's vibing out in the background. There we go, all right. All right. Tied 1-1. One, one. Yeah, and the bursts are gonna be pretty comparable, so it's really gonna be who gets to hit first. Yeah. Nice to see, okay. Oh, there, J2K. Finally shows J2K. Nice. Okay, right. so it's a bit, oh, oh no. unfortunate burst there. Not dead off this. No, really not, tough but situation. Gotta get the knockdown here. All right, spend the meter to get the knockdown. Yep. All right, what's the next? Oh, you can't even see. Okay. Oh, you can't even see him. How are you supposed to block? You gotta guess. You know. You just guess. You just commit. Okay. All right. The first one goes to pass. Now, uh, either B. Played Skullgirls for a pretty good amount of time. <laughs> okay. All right. Nice right there, there for Major Reed there. All right. Now I'm getting a little bit more aggressive. I like this choice. Yep. Um, I like the choice to change up the pace. Yeah, Chip's one of those characters where it's really hard to play reaction towards it. Absolutely. At some point, you just got to take a risk and like make sure you cash out enough on that. Oh, and there we go. Oh, what a blitz. Okay, blitz back first. What's the part of it? Nice throw. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Wow. Nice. Not enough to kill, though. Good back dash. This is not going to be a knockdown. Uh -huh. Oh my god, yo! We just you know, get onto the helicopter mode. Nice match from that. Tons of meter by it with spray to beat those. Yeah, all, a whole stick of butter. Uh -huh. yep. Yep, 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 yep. yep. And even if, yeah, and then you get to RC after that, yep. even if Pat blocks it. If Pat blocks, it doesn't matter. I'll do something else. Yeah. If Pat gets hit, I oh, can make kill it pay. Him. That's power meter, baby. Okay. We all wish we could turn the whole back up. But you know, like we're we're sure. here here in Knockout. We're luckily like blessed to have offline, like, yeah, big offline tournaments. So. It's all the work people like, uh, you know, that come on out. Like people like Aether V Custom and all the yep. all the new names. It's just looking like very good for Pat this round. Ooh. So. All right. Oh my God, okay. Yozansen. Oh no, drop. Yes. Nice. What a call out. Oh, trying to go for some big combos. Oh, yep. All right. All right. Past that point, but uh, his ability been here before. Was here before against Brad. It yeah, it's just, we so we ran uh, Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3 earlier, and we ran uh, Rev 2. Those are the two tournaments we ran today. Um, Rev 2 is a constant. Marvel this is the first time we had Marvel 3, I think. No, second time. Second time, yeah. second time. But Rev 2 is a constant nice here. Nice Yep. Yeah, we're gonna hit the knockdown. We have some setups, like, for people playing plus R in the back, but we don't run plus R. So okay, really good. so here we go. What do you think the mix-up's gonna be? We thought regular. We just run one before. It has to burst. All right. This is it. A big advantage for Pat. Nice. All right, looking really good. Oh yeah, that should be it, I think. Yep. And all right, and Pat ends Aether Beat's run. Yeah. Pat but pushes away. Four. Give it up for Aether Beat. Woo! <laughs> Pat slamming <laughs> <laughs> this is also a classic. He wants it back. He's like, yo, the whole reason I called you out here is because I just wanted you to know. Well, sorry, it's sick. <laughs> I just wanted you to know, bro. It's a little bit trickier to to run since it's only on PS4, right? Like, PC setups are not very viable for offline. But so, generally, you got to get the PS3 setups. It's a little bit trickier to get those out. But yeah, plus is a fun game. I, I played that game, too. Okay. So, this is Loser's Finals. Winner of this will get their shot at Dave Endo. So uh, either Effortless will get the run back or Pat will get his first attempt to fight Dave today. So, here we go. 
And uh, Pat, of course, has been putting a lot of work against uh, Sly, but uh, Sly very different, way more aggressive. So yeah. it'll be interesting to see how. Yeah, they're two very different styles of Johnny. Yeah. Get that down. Yep. <laughs> All right. Level three, four coin. Yeah, and and you notice like Effortless is playing a lot more on the back foot right now, but right? has level like has a life lead, level through mid finder on deck. Like, I mean, he can chill. He exactly. knows that if he gets a clean, clean hit, he can take like seventy percent of his life. Right, but that's the that's the point, right? Is like he's really kind of forcing Pat to have to be the aggressor, and that's really scary. All right. I got a lot of meter on deck here. Gets the counter yeah. hit. All right, Everyone burst. is very patient with Walker right now. Doesn't mind. Oh. Oh, drop the combo, though. Big break for Pat. Not only does uh, he not die, <laughs> uh, Everless loses his levels. You know, Johnny needs those levels to get big damage. It also looks like Johnny might have tried to do a YRC. I saw his, like... Like, pose in the air for a second. Oh there. my god, yeah, you have to RP that. You're gonna die, man. Okay, alright. Pat, doing the tricky stuff right now. It's kind of working out. Damn, still in the first round. It's been yeah. a pretty long first round. Especially against Chip, it's pretty... It's going to time right now, but yeah. Now, I feel like it's getting a little bit more uh, aggressive now. Okay, nice. What a throw! Well, that's gonna be enough, I think. That's just enough? No. no, no, one more chance. But the time, well, there's not enough time. Yeah. There's not, he needed like one big hit, but there's no way he's was gonna just going to keep him locked down there. Yeah, only two exactly. seconds. Damn, that's crazy. It's actually been a while since I've, you see it sometimes, but it's been a while since I've seen the game almost go to time. Right. That's doing it. And Johnny. One character has high damage, the other character has no health. Nice. Yep. Okay. Yeah, I think uh, there's an input there from Pat there. Yeah, but it doesn't, doesn't get too bad because he didn't get knocked down because his lie was two hits instead of a one hit. All right, cheap. Okay, with a knockdown. What's the mix up? All right, not enough to kill. Get the knockdown. Oh, he's, he's going for the gut crush. Ooh, he's eating it, but I guess, uh, you know, I think those were calculated gambles by Pat because he realized that Epilus didn't have levels, so he right. didn't mind getting clipped a few times. You know, he, he knew he wouldn't be, like, wouldn't bleed off of it. Oh, oh no. No, the tip player's vein bursting with some very bad spots. Yo, he is fishing with two at, or two D. Giant two D is really good. It can anti air sometimes. There's a knockdown. Out. Oh my god. The tech trap laser beam, and that's just game one. Okay. That's sick. All hundred. Like uh, I don't know how to pronounce the tag type. Langren? I think that's the whole point of those those, uh, those videos. It's like great if people are actually viewing them, like those sessions. You want people to get better. Yeah. Even you know, even if they're not necessarily in our specific community, you want the play, like the level of play everyone to get better. Yeah, I mean, we get better. That's the whole reason why it's like split up in the things that new people should do and things you should do against the character because right. it really covers the entire spread of whether or not you want to play the character or if you want to tip to how to do the character from. Uh, Someone who's a little bit more knowledgeable. Okay. All right. Well, Pat right in the mix evens out the life total. Oh, nice 60. 60. Okay. Maybe the knockdown. Oh no. Oh no, he's gonna delete. Okay. Oh no. Nice throw. Okay. Yeah, shout out to Cavs though. Hopefully we can uh, get him back here soon. Oh, nice. All right. <laughs> the camera shot broken. The, no, it's, it's the singular main, like, organism. They all are simulated. Yeah. <laughs> okay, level three, though. Oh, oh my god, the yep. blitz, the oh, blitz, no. back. 
Not too bad though. Oh, Johnny sucks. Oh, this is this oh, dead. That's that absolute, oh no! Thompson would have been dead because that little wrist. That so wrist. it did not matter. The reset takes it. All right, effortless ties up the round count. That plus, yep. Now look at Everless is just oh, being very cautious right now, and it's paying dividends. Ooh, doesn't get the knockdown. But you can see uh, Everless tends to play more aggressively once he has a level because right. you As did, you this finder cancel will give you way more advantage. And you can basically, if you're sharp enough, you can convert this off almost anything. Right. And this is the thing right now, I think like, oh. I think this, uh. This pace of like. What the, a 16. Nice to see, yeah. This pace of what Everless is doing where he's, uh, just. You know, kind of just letting the opponent do whatever they want yeah. and being a little safe. The problem there is, is that Pat puts in the air. Didn't like your death when he landed. Oh, okay. All right, 2 0 Everless. Yeah. This is a best of five, so. Pat's got to fight back from here if he wants to stay in the tournament. Yep. This is the game of the grand finals. Nice. Oh my god, look at the. Down. He's oh. bleeding! A little bit of risk. And now he's getting so aggressive. Oh my god. Unblockables. Double coin. Oh no! It's a blockable. What he got a back dash! No, no, no. He had the right idea. The double coin setup, you want to tap with back dash. But it's hard. That's the thing. Like, Think about like the timing you have to do. You have to, you have to get your reversal blitz timing, then you have to back dash. So it's, it's a hard answer. And then once they know you're going to do that, they have other, they can rotate their setup. Right, well, exactly. Right. Okay, get the hot down. Double blitz, oh man. <laughs> All right, Pat trying to get as a The problem right now is that yeah. this damage, like every time Pat gets a touch, it's not like, it's not doing nearly as much as when he gets touched. Sorry. Oh no, drops oh. off six, big five eight counter, but nothing off of it. Oh, oh. no. Okay, not not a lot of damage for effortless at least. Alright. So, okay, pass. Pass fighting back. Fight fighting back and erasing that meter advantage. Yeah, but it's still it's still a set point for effortless. Right it now. is. Oh now he's now he's not respecting the pattern up there. Okay. You didn't get coined though, so. Yeah. Or maybe he just looked at second one. Okay, burst. Oh, oh, oh boy. Oh no. That's not the worst. You know, OTG, OTG burst, and also like, you don't get the coin. Like, it's very difficult to to burst Johnny, uh, just because he can miss finder cancel, basically everything, and make himself safe. Um, but. I think it's very worthwhile spending your burst so he can't coin you. Right, right. So that's what Pat was aiming for there with that OTG burst. Burst right before the coin hit. Since OTG burst, they can't really punish him hard. Okay. He five them with the coin. So here's the question. What's the... Nice challenge. Looking pretty good for Pat. Oh, just as I say. All right, it's not down. Nice. Back back down. That's I oh, my God. Oh, it doesn't, doesn't get conversion. Too hard. Yo, we swing swinging six weeks. Oh my god, this is looking. Oh, this is. This oh, is that. level three. This is that. That's it. <laughs> that is yeah, out. It, just, it all falls apart so Pat quickly. Out at third. But good shit to Pat. It was 3 0, but it was close. All though. right. All right. Effortless back in grand finals. Yep. Trying to run it back against uh, Damon. Dave, Dave, yeah. Yeah, Jay Mendo versus Effortless. So, oftentimes, you'll find Jay and Effortless in deep thought about what's about to happen. Because yeah. this, is, this is just about as much as fighting each other in your mind as it is fighting each other like because you know, you're not going to get a lot of opportunities like you gotta take them 
You gotta take advantage of all your opportunities in this matchup. So. Both these characters are high damage characters, piloted exactly. by people who actually, you know, consistently hit the high damage yeah. runs. You can't make that many mistakes. Exactly. So here we go. Oh, oh no. Okay, yeah, not so bad right now, but uh, Peter's being extremely aggressive right now. Okay, we're gonna let level, level three. three. Level three. Yep. Good situation for Johnny. Good back Oh dash. no, get thrown oh. in the corner. Nice. Get the knockdown. Yep. Right. Alright, close slash didn't get anything off of it. Looks like kind of an awkward hit. What a blitz in the air! Oh my god. Okay, that's actually a huge trade for for Ephraim. But it doesn't matter in the end because he had meter to convert, so. Yeah, Mendo takes the first point. Yep. So Mendo very creative with the escape. Mixes yeah. is up decent amount. Like sometimes we'll go for that uh that air dash. Right. Um, foot loose. Foot sometimes we'll just yeah. do something less risky but not as fast. Or not as fast. Okay, so All yeah, right. level two right now for uh Ethelid. Oh my god. Oh. 60 beat out the 5 age. Johnny great, it's a great. Uh, or sorry, Slayer 6 is a stop. It's a great, it's a great uh, counter, -poke. counter poke, yeah. Oh, okay, immediately burst. Ooh. Ooh. got a lot of resources, oh. but because it's just level, oh wait. Well, he gets a level though, now he can get conversion. Next clean touch to kill for Everless. Okay, nice IB, okay. Yep. Yep. And that's what we're talking about, right? You don't get a lot of opportunities, so like you gotta take advantage of them and everyone clutches that one out. Oh my god. The short dash into the other course. <laughs> yeah. For for those who uh, might not know, Slayer actually has two dash distances. If he holds his four dash. Like he, if you do like six six and you hold the the second six you can do a longer dash. Yeah. Oh, nice conversion. It's gonna get. No! Yeah, because of his first. Alright. First game. Goes to Demendo. Yep. Alright. Immediately wants to run that, like the rematch right now. Okay. Nice. Close flash. Oh, right. Good match on the reset attempt. Ooh, nice 2D. Yep. Level 3. Wow. Really? Throws him out? Oh, what's no, his name? Not gonna work. It does. It's a low profile on the 6P. Yeah, 6P just said it doesn't matter what your name is. Oh, we got right, level 3. Though. Missed. Yep. You can see Mappa. Alright, level 3 unblockable is not going to be a factor now. Oh! I just about to, oh my god. It's, Peter's really good about like hitting you and then crossing you. Like you think there's gonna be a combo and then he just crosses you up and just like resets you and you die. Yep. It's funny because I, I think a lot of players like to do that, but man, <laughs> Peter does some places that you really don't expect. Right, exactly. Like you're like, okay, he'll just finish me off, right? And then it's like, actually, he gave you a chance to live and you didn't take it. And you know, you take notes of stuff like that. Like, yep. Right. And once again, a similar situation for Everless as it was before. Big damage. Found, Popped but. by the uh, YYRC. One more clean hit. That should be it. Oh, oh no, no, this is it. Shoot. Yeah, Johnny Rouse are pretty, pretty tricky. Pretty character specific. Yeah, weight specific. Alright. 2 8. Plus another one out. Oh, not 2 8. That's a. 2 8? Slide. Yeah, well, like the double splash. Oh, yeah, out. that's yeah. 2D. Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. 2D closing that one out. Ooh, doesn't get the coin, though. A lot of times, you just you don't mind getting hit by Johnny if he doesn't get the coins up. Right. Oh, you don't want to get hit by Slayer, though. Right. Oh, oh, no. oh no! Oh, some really unfortunate situations there now. Nice flip. Okay, yep. held it. <laughs> it's cross up, but <laughs> pops him back the other way. Oh, fighting game interactions are so funny. Should be enough. 
Nice. nice. All right. That really ties it up. One one. Breeze is a big size relief. Okay. Let's see how day adapts. Okay, so right now, now, now we're getting, we're, we're going back to that like slow, like neutral, like just kind of ducking and weaving a little bit. But just as I say that, we're swinging. Oh, okay. It's pretty big. Like, like one of the benefits of playing Slayer is like you just damage you to build meter in that situation. Um, so the opponent doesn't really want to like just let you do that. So you can't get caught uh, in a bad situation based on that. But right now. Okay, gets in that time, I think, yep. Yep, nice. My total is pretty even. Oh, Spence All right, yeah, Spence the meter is trying to get the... the oh, no! I like oh, the no. choice because uh, it would have ended with another level 3 misfire, but uh, that, that drop was massive. Okay. Jay right now trying to uh, take the lead. Okay, I do on the Mappa. Good idea. Oh, oh 16. Yeah, I guess he sniffed out there that uh, Ethelitz was going to count. Oh, yeah. no. This card matches, but not punished too hard. Yeah, Johnny's kind of heavy, so I assume Maxi can be a little bit tricky to pick up off the counter hit. Uh, it's late. Oh, oh good spacing, yeah. yeah. Because it was dizzy. Nothing, nothing like Ethelitz effortless could have really done there. Absolutely. Day now. Got the lead, 2-1. Oh. And I, I generally seem to think that, like, Ethelist is a lot better against uh, Jay after, like, the first set. Like, he gets a really, he gets a better feel of what he's supposed to do. Um, he's got still a lot of games to play on the table, but uh, Jay is extremely clutch. Okay. It is known. Yeah, it is known that Peter has that clutch factor. Oh boy. Not dead. Not dead, yeah. Just One extremely more. bleeding. Oh, oh that's gonna be it. Death. Okay. Jay Bendo on tournament point. Yep. Mark Cali burst. I think all the open ones that Peter's participated in, he just won all of them, right? Like Mark Cali burst. Uh, I'm thinking at least with PPG running right there. Yeah. Nice throw. Nice throw. Get your offense started. Down. Here we go. It's time. Up. Oh, I yeah, earned BDC. this. Yeah, BDC Mob has been putting it. Uh, oh my god. Yep. First. Yeah, trying to get that advantage right now. Trying to take all that he can with the pressure. Oh, hello? Oh, I was going to say, Demand has been really good about sniffing out when. Uh, I feel like he's gonna go in and just escape me at that point, but not this round. Ooh. And that and that whiff burst could be huge right yeah. now. I feel like is at least, you know, even though it was a whiff burst, at least it was a gold burst. So yeah. with the gold burst, you're like guaranteed to get the B back. Right, exactly. Basically, so about 20% of your burst. Also, it's a little, it's harder to punish. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Gold burst, you are striking bone until you hit the ground. Right. And then when you hit the ground, there's no landing recovery. Yet. It's good. Looks like he beat the startup to two maybe. Okay, okay, we're gonna get the knockdown. Right, we gotta work around this right. meter. We gotta work around this meter. Oh, what a blitz! Blitz back! Oh, oh Day Mando! Okay, what's the mix up? Oh, wow, just bite the 6K! That's, That's, That's it. it. That's it. And right. Day Mando takes it. Your March 2022 Caliber Champion, Capion Day Mando. Yep. Oh, good shit. Thank you for coming out and th thanks to everybody who came out and everybody who uh, came to watch. Right. Um, you know, we took February off because it was the right thing to do after Frosty. Right, exactly. Like, you don't want to bring everyone in when they've been to Frosty. <laughs> exactly. You don't know, want Cali Burst. We're not trying to have Cali Burst. Yeah! Woo! Good shit. Thank you so
right on that man. Yeah. Yo, let's go co-opted cup. Co-opted cup is co such, such a cup. good name. <laughs> <laughs> you can't even be mad. What are you going to call it? You're right, gonna, exactly. I, I was up front. Name, it's literally in the name. Exactly. It's co-opted. <laughs> Yeah, so you got to be good to one another and you got to play some motherfucking guilty gear. All right, so yeah, so that that is our announcement. So April is Caliverse will be Team Exhibition 3 racing. So if you, I heard SoCal might want to come up. So if SoCal wants to come up in April, uh, you know, it's we welcomed time. you so eloquently last time. <laughs> if the Wild West crew wants to come up again, I know we want to run back. So, <laughs> you know, oh, no. if you're interested. I mean, we love seeing our SoCal people. We Absolutely. love seeing out of, like, town people. We had no man, no, or we had not Noah. Yeah, we had uh, Havoc Noah show up. Havoc once. Noah, yep. So. All right, so uh, I think that wraps it up for us. For oh wait, Pat wants the mic. Let's I just want to make sure I sign out for the crew. Okay. In case, in case uh, they didn't hear it, hey, thank you all for watching the stream. Really appreciate it. Oh, there we go. Sick. Always, we appreciate you coming through. We'll see you for Rev Tuesday. We'll th see you for only mids coming up on the 19th. We got Espada and the Tag and Battle crew holding it down for Rev 2 on the 26th. There's going to be all kinds of Rev 2 up in this for March. It's going to be great. But don't forget, April Cali Burst, we're running the Power of Friendship, a.k.a. the Co-Opted Cup. We'll be running a 3v3 team exhibition, so we'll definitely see y'all there. Yep. If you are planning on traveling in from out of town for this shit, let us know so we can get you matched yep. up. It's going to be a good ass time. We know the SoCal boys are coming through, yeah. and they're trying to do some damage. They whooped our ass in the 3v3 and during Russia Mania, so I don't know. Maybe we can find something for them this time. Yeah, maybe. All, all I'm saying is I would love to see some of our former teams come back. I would love to see the Pogi Boy reunion. Personally. Simo, Jules, where are you at, baby? We could yeah. do this. And I'm really excited to see the, the potential for some coaching. I want to see some people s sharing that knowledge, you know. Who knows? Maybe we'll see the carpool from hell. Maybe we'll yeah, see maybe. Team 7. Mapuchito, if you're out there, let me know if you're trying to come down and, get, and bring back the last kids picked. True. Whatever it takes. All right. So I think Starsky's got to pack up his shit now. He's, got, he's a busy man. He's got shit to do. He's always yeah. got, like, concert. Are you, are you fucking VJing again or whatever? Oh, Yo, let's go. We, are Yo, holding, also, yeah. we are holding this man up for his own birthday party. All right, so Starsky's birthday was very recently. I think yeah. it was like Thursday or something. Yeah, happy yeah. birthday, motherfucker. Happy birthday. Thank you for coming out and giving us your time, as always. Absolutely. So we'll let Starsky fuck off to his birthday party. Until then, you know what we're going to do. We're going to love our life. lives, be good, good to, to one, one another, another, and play, play some, some motherfucking guilty gear. We out, baby. Mwah. All right, roll that outro.
この番組はご覧のスポンサーの提供でお送りします。